feel sudden waves of inexplicable fear, anger, jealousy, and hysteria. Uh, in the sky, it's a bird, it's a plane Flying high, I emerge through the flames Have no fear, I'm here, so stand back Melanin, activate the name, is super black In the sky, it's a bird, it's a plane Flying high, I emerge through the flames Have no fear, I'm here, so stand back Melanin, activate the name, is super black uh, Imagine that, a future that's super black Long as your skin brown, your superpowers intact what would your powers be? Just hope it ain't super whack. Spatial manipulation, create a portal that's black. Maybe just super speed, time travel to run it back. Or cheat manipulation to keep my spirit intact. As I encounter evils the world face, demons the world makes. I needed the world to stay. Rest in peace to Chad, what they killed all the Black Panthers. Told us white lies, I still marvel at black answers. Suits in DC, pray it lead to a civil war. It ain't no justice league. What's the need to be civil for? Propel like the juggernaut, it's clear, ain't no stopping. This. The world in grave danger, who can stop the apocalypse? They killed all the heroes, the new ones don't really care But if you need me, put your fist up in the air Yeah, in the sky, it's a bird, it's a plane Flying high, I emerge through the flames Have no fear, I'm here, so stand back Melanin, activate the name, is super black In the sky, it's a bird, it's a plane Flying high, I emerge through the flames. Have no fear, I'm here, so stand back. Melanin, activate the name is Super Black. Hey, everybody, what is going on on a special night? Thanks to technical difficulties, but we are back. Uh, looks like the Squirrels couldn't keep us down too much longer. Uh, thank you for tuning in, everybody. I'm your host, the man on the wall, Chris Fury. Thank you for tuning in to Blurred's Eye View if this is your first time. Thank you. You won't be disappointed. Go check us out on the IG page and follow the link tree in the bio, and you can find us everywhere on Facebook, YouTube, uh, Always Press Record. Shout out to Trey Lawson. Opulence Radio. Shout out to Amron Burnett. Uh, we are moving in major ways right now that you couldn't even understand. Uh, as I said earlier, if you've seen the IG live that I did earlier today uh, or, or just a few moments ago, actually, uh, I told people that we do things backstage that, you know, keeps people entertained. And that's not the nasty stuff. So get your minds out the gutter, people. We don't get down like that. Uh, that's for Blurred's Eye View After Dark. We'll figure that out later. Until then, we will start this thing off because we are talking about the flash and the blackening. And uh, a little, little news peppered in there as well. So uh, let's start this thing off right with the lady of the ship, our weapons master, Lady Mandalore. What's going on? You're muted. <laughs> She's muted. She's muted. <laughs> one, there she is. <laughs> one time I'm going to get it right. I'm <laughs> gun blazing, ready to go. Hey, this happens to the best of us. Trust me. After after that fiasco from last night, blew out the entire oh. couple blocks. Oh, oh. yeah. Apparently, oh, was a, apparently, apparently, there was a car crash or something. That's what. That's what this. That's the story that's being told. Mm. <laughs> look at Christy D says again with the mute. <laughs> I know. I can't look. Shush. I'm because if I listen, look, it's 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 real down to the wire over here on my side of the camera. Uh, <laughs> look. <laughs> look. Don't feel bad. Uh, there was for a while there. I kept sounding like I was in Bikini Bottom, and th that is not a slight to what's been going on. I literally did sound like I was underwater. That's just I, what it is. I feel like <laughs> if you say it, is it it turns into it no matter. Yeah, what. it does. Yeah, it does. <laughs> that's why I always check. I like I got into that habit of just checking. I check it every time. I check. I'm like, why is my camera doing that? Nope, this shouldn't do that. It should do that. <laughs> Lord, um, <laughs> uh, and we got them. <laughs> hey, the what it is? What to do? I had to stop myself. So I was going to there saying, "Just sit right back, and I'll tell you a tale of <laughs> nothing." Shit. We all, we all got a ticket. All the black, all the black Twitter got a ticket. It's just what it is. It's it's gonna be a party. It's a party. I, I don't think. I, if anything, they might just boot us back out. So I don't. I'm not really worried. 
Uh, yeah. <laughs> no, we're I'm not. Sorry, this so, for this disclaimer, we're not making Good fun Lord. of the loss of life. Of, of the loss of life, we are making fun of the low IQs, low IQs, and <laughs> poor decisions mm. that led to this whole thing. That's what we're because Reed Richards would never. Uh, <laughs> So. It was it was it was not our best shining moment as Humanity. a society. No. Oh, there's an pineapple under the sea. <laughs> you, you held, it. You held that one. You held that one. I, I couldn't. I couldn't they, do were, it. they were expecting it from me. Oh, I couldn't God. do it. I oh. oh God. On, on, that, on that note, we got our we got our favorite cousin, one of our favorite cousins in the building. Navy Montel is here. Hey. Under the sea, under the sea. Okay, that's all I gotta say about that. It wasn't me. It wasn't me. What's uh, going on, you are... sexy people? Beautiful <laughs> times. Beautiful times. I love it, especially it, when when uh, uh when uh... it was funny. <laughs> it, I'm sorry, it was funny. Listen, because we were just like, there's no way possible. There's listen, no way we, all, possible. we all need the laugh. It was a there's a laugh billion. Th there's mo there's a multitude of, of billions of people on this planet. Five, bring them back, I'm bring, them back Verb. bring them all back. Bring them back now. Uh, send them the link. Uh, wow. <laughs> like, I, when I first heard that news, the only thing I could think of was, how do you bolt the outside without creating a re egress to get out? Whose and, idea and, was this? And, and and Montel is our is is you are the resident, the veteran you are resident of the person. Navy. You would know. Hello. There's so no way in the world because yeah. you and and okay, folks. Here here's a little bit of science lesson for you. The further down you go, the tighter it gets. It's like for yeah. every for every six seven feet, you're adding a a fat person of three hundred pounds on your back every time. The further down you go, the more fat people get on your back. So guess mm -hmm. what? Something's gonna give, mm -hmm. and I yep. saw that. And I was like, "Wow, you mean with everything else going on, y'all are focusing on these <coughs> digits? This is what we're doing." Yeah, this, uh, this I'm is sorry. why, this is why all, math and all, science but... are so critical in this day and age because death pressure and oceanic and oceanic pressure are highly under are highly underestimated right now. Mm, that part, I mean, it's, 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 the Titanic it's, of all things. It's science. It's I just want to bring back for the killer whales it's right science. now because the killer whales would be like, "Look, before y'all start pointing the finger at us, this was not it. us." <laughs> I'm not gonna lie; I felt bad for the 18 year old because he had foreshadowing, and mm -hmm. they made his father made him go. He said he was scared to do this, and his father made him go. I was like, "Are no, you kidding me?" Yes, I, I, I felt one, like, I, one I time. Like, yeah, because that'd be the one time I would have folded on my dad. I'm like, look, you whoop my ass, but I ain't getting on the ship. <laughs> Cinematic will. assassin will be watching in the building. What up, Will? <laughs> Waiting on Laney to pop back in. I seen Laney. I'm like, what happened to Laney? The, <laughs> the entire struggle to get in. Like, I was like, hey, we still black. We good? We good? Hello? We good. I'm texting the chat. <laughs> I go to YouTube to start sharing the link out. I was like, oh, we live? Oh, we y'all just gonna give me the wrong link. Oh, okay, that's what we I know. It was in the chat. Yeah. It was in the chat. <laughs> I used the one in the chat. And I'm just looking at a blank screen. <laughs> then on my iPad, I see y'all key, key, key. And I was like, oh, <laughs> how y'all gonna do me? Oh, not the not the we have some bad news to it tell was, you, sir. Yes. <laughs> uh, but wow. our very own Laney from Geek hey, Lady. Lady. It's well, a party. Lady. <laughs> Oh uh, yeah, the exactly the waiver and the Forget joystick. Science, the waiver and joystick for the yeah. Was it a Logitech? Rec uh, yeah, Logitech. Logitech. It was Logitech. Boy, Logitech got Logitech got on social so quick and was like, "Please Look. do not use our joysticks for aquatic for aquatic uh, vehicles <laughs> or submersibles." There, was it really Logitech? Like, yeah, it was, yeah. Really yeah, Logitech. It was, Logitech. It was yeah. a Super yeah. NES, and that, and that came yeah. that came out of his mouth. Mm -hmm. he, he boasted was, he about that. He, he was flexing. Oh my God. Like but, it was. Logitech well, came out with one tweet and said, "What in us?" Yeah, was it? Was, was it their, their stock was about they to end. Like they had to say something. It's like you ain't you ain't gonna blame us for your stuff. Yeah, as a fact. that was that was so bad. I you know, and all I could think of is like, really, dude? That's 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 what you want to flex on. And then and then he's like, not even God could sink it. Well. There it is. No, uh, I kind of felt like God it. was like, "Oh, really?" He didn't say that. Yeah. Don't yeah. put that. Don't lie like he, that. He That's said that. Far. 
He yeah, said that. He God said that. No, he said that. He, no. When he was when like they a were metal asking, tadpole. What yeah, when the he was, when they were asking him about what all this thing was built out of and everything else, he actually said that. And I'm like, I feel like I feel like I, DJ Khaled come out nowhere. God did. I just <laughs> want to go on record as saying, whoever is complaining about us laughing, he laughed first. <laughs> exactly. Okay, he laughed at God. He did it. Though. We yeah. didn't do that. You decided, you, you decided to part. test the universe, and the universe sat there and proved you wrong. Mm-hmm. So, well, well. You know, you know, it ain't us. Right I'm now, right, right now, right there's over. right now they're sitting at the, at the table with the big man, and he's just looking at him like. <laughs> you thought. <laughs> you thought. <laughs> this is not you how. When I gave it. you the gifts, <laughs> I gave you. The, I didn't. Can you just imagine him right? Can you imagine what they're right now with St. Peter? So you decide to test God. Pretty much. Mm-hmm. Just pretty, pretty much. <laughs> to see the Titanic. It's just I don't understand. We, that. This was the look of black Twitter. Like. Yeah. <laughs> Shimon. <laughs> you paid like we, we knew. just to go into a tin can to see a sunken ship. That literally you can see from Google Earth. <laughs> Save yourself two hundred fifty grand. But you we gotta good. touch it. We gotta touch it. We gotta touch. Oh, touch they touch it. it. They touch it now. They're, they're touching it now. <laughs> they're touching Somewhere it now. Sebastian is singing "Under the Sea." Under the right. Sea. It wasn't them more. So we're not putting that on him. <laughs> I mean, what was, what was, what was, it, it comes with a pool Arthur. noodle. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah. Actually, it was like, bad. They showed James Cameron's up submersible, and it looked way different for ten million dollars. Exactly. Yeah. It, they showed this. It's it, there were so many. I don't. Yeah. Your price. James this Cameron's is, had buttons. Yeah. yeah. Like, it's, it's, when James Cameron actually said, "There's no way in hell." It had lights and triggers <laughs> and shit. <laughs> yeah. Why do people seem to think that smaller is better? Look, you need to equip that bad boy. You pause. need to put layers upon layers. <laughs> oh, pause. Pause. Yeah. Wait a minute. <laughs> oh, I pause. said what I said. <laughs> oh my god. But at the same it's... time, I mean, Sorry. come on. <laughs> Sorry, Paul so, liked it small, so that's it, what we it, did. It's, it, so, oh. dude, so are we? So here's the thing. Are we laughing at their death? No. 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 God. no one is actually. No one is. No. We're laughing at the poor decisions that led to this. Darwinism. I <laughs> laugh at the Three Stooges. They do dumb shit all the goddamn time. I, 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 you know what this is? is no different it, in my opinion. It is literally. It is. It is survival of the fittest in its purest form. It is the mm. law of the jungle in aquatic form. There you go. It it is. I, I'm, I'm. All I'm saying is, this was this a canon event? I need to it know. Is, it is the oh, caucasity are, and oh. audacity. Oh was this God. a canon event? It's a oh. canon of caucasity. That's someone what it is. It's a caucasity event. This is the Popeyes chicken sandwich all over again. Wow. That's what this is. Wow. Now, here's the irony. I have a Popeye's that is right behind my apartment complex, and they had to close the Joker down because it kept getting rammed into. (laughs) After the sixth accident, they said, you know, we need to change and close this thing down. I'm telling you, this sort of thing isn't working in 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 the neighborhood. So what we're going to do is we're going to shut it down. You know, after six times, I think think it's not an accident. I think that's more of a come on line. (laughs) Somebody get Miguel O'Hara on the line because before that did, Come here, it keeps baby. happening. Let me shut it down for you. Come here. That's not what your insurance claim that just keeps getting repeated over and over again until somebody had got with. Hey, he's like, didn't I talk to you like a month ago? Uh, it's, mm. <laughs> oh my god, yeah. So, uh, uh, we're sorry for the families, obviously. We're sorry for the, that the families are dealing with this loss. Mm. Uh, but I'm, I'm pretty sure in the back of their mind, they're just like. I told him not to do that. Is it really petty that maybe some of them are contacting lawyers and seeing what happens with uh, how the wheels are going to go? Oh, if he, you know what? It well, between the wheels because they definitely can't sue the company. Right? They can't, they can't sue. They can't sue anybody. There's I mean, they had a, they, they had a billionaire and his son on mm-hmm. the damn submersible, and the she, only one left is his wife. That lady deserves all of that. Yeah. Her I'm husband and that. her son? Come on, man. So it just, it just, looks it up, just, man. just goes to show you 
not every idea is a good idea. But at the same time as black folks, when we heard there was no black people on this sub, uh, you can't help but feel a little bit of whoo. Oh, we knew better. <laughs> yeah, it's like we, we, we knew better. Oh, a little no bit. <laughs> we knew better. It was just like, mm-mm, 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 mm-mm. That's not us. <laughs> That, that doesn't even sound black. Jay Z, no. P Diddy, all of them. What we, I need to go down there for? I mean, we'll take a boat on the water, but we ain't gonna go underwater. We, we, and we, we, we're we're just getting to that. Right. <laughs> so we're just getting we're getting accustomed to we're getting accustomed to yachts and cruises and whatnot. Hell, we're getting accustomed. We're getting accustomed to showering. What are you talking Dude. about? <laughs> <laughs> there were so many red flags. Like there was PTSD no under the shower head. <laughs> Like you had a you had a urinal bucket like that's messed up. You had to sit what? down. Yeah, there was no, it was a, it wasn't a, it wasn't a spot you can go to. It was more like prison. You squatted yeah. down for the world to see, and that's a that's a you weren't you weren't you weren't, you weren't you weren't tethered. I mean, oh, you're not tethered to the you weren't tethered to the mothership. So in case something like this would happen, mm-hmm. they can pull you back in because they lost contact. And here's the other thing, and I kind of figured this, and I'm and I'm with Navy on this. I kind of figured, you know, you you always got to hold out some kind of hope, obviously, mm-hmm. you know. But I kind of figured when they said they lost contact, my mind was like, mm, it was done. that's something that small. It's, and I was yeah. telling people at my job, I said that thing was done the minute they lost contact. They, yeah. they just couldn't say that to the media. And wasn't, it, and wasn't the Titanic at one of the lowest parts of the ocean that dang yes. near nothing can get to? Yes. <laughs> So it's just like y'all, y'all might as well just go ahead and make peace with God. <laughs> yeah. So <sighs> rest in peace to those people. Uh let this be a lesson to others out there. Like, do not make bonehead <laughs> decisions like that again. Uh, there's a reason why they have equipment that goes down there to take care of those type of situations. Though it's it's not necessary to do that. So uh I have learned nothing. Or two hundred fifty grand, build your own aquarium. Do that. Yeah. yeah. Have your home under the sea at home. It's a lot easier. You can get exactly. out. Just, you can get just out sit back, just sit back and sit back and watch it at home. I mean, uh, so I will say, I'm at San Diego Comic Con. So. Yes. <laughs> speaking of which, speaking of which, nice segue. It's called a happy accident because uh news has been coming out about Comic Con. Uh Marvel will not have a, a uh standing in Hall H. Neither will Netflix, Sony, HBO, or Universal. They're all skipping San Diego Comic Con. Oh hey, listen, yeah. listen, listen. Is, no bullshit. Isn't DC skipping it too. <laughs> we sh- we should apply I, I, I don't for a think panel. They, I, I don't apply think. for a panel. We should apply for a panel. Ain't nobody gonna be there. I mean, they gonna put on stage. We get all H. We get all H. Let's go. Oh, oh my gosh, that nice would be try, one, but somebody that, would be there to fill that, in. Yeah. That's one. That'd be one hell of a way for the for <laughs> Lord to get on. And be like, look. I mean, you know, if you think about it, San Diego is that Earth Dean Winchester? Get him over here. <laughs> we, got all, we got Hall H. Lord's out. Lord's out. What is this? Oh, let me go in here and go. Let me go. Yeah, that's all I need. That, that's all we need. That one pair of curiosity. Where it's, is a, that it's, you? A, it's a two oh, hour wow, panel. Of really Tyrese dope. talking about what was supposed to happen with Morbius. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Those guys seem really dope. Let's go check them out. It's Bird's Eye so, View. We're not sure. It, it could be because of SAG. Mm-hmm. Uh, it could be because the strike is going on. Like, you know, it's this, this thing is still going. This thing is still going. Mm-hmm. And, uh, Come on, bring it in. He's coming. Uh, <laughs> there he is. Yes. Captain Buffering. Hey, bro. <laughs> Did you call and Captain the cousins Buffering? have come together again. It's like Voltron up in this Captain joint. Captain Buffering. <laughs> so, where's, where's Lainey? Is she going to nap? She's she's restarting her computer. Yeah. Oh, um, so, it's, it's no. <laughs> So Hall H is there's not going to be a, apparently there's not going to be a lot of news coming out of Hall H because these are like some of the major ones that we are normally hearing from. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Um, I believe the writer strike is one of the factions. Uh, everything else that we find out, we kind of catch it quick anyway, mm-hmm. you know. Yeah. So yeah. 
it, it's it's unfortunate. They said Paramount Pictures is expected to hold a panel for their animated features for Turtle uh, Ninja Tur- for the TM Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Uh, and I know they just recently sc- uh, canceled Star Trek Prodigy, so that's yeah. not going to be on the docket. <sighs> yeah, Paramount canceled a lot of stuff lately here. Yeah, yeah they Paramount dropped a lot of, of shows. Days. They dropped they dropped a lot of shows. But see, this is a this is a cool. This is becomes the question of, do you see what's happening? You know, mm-hmm. your writers are on strike. Your actors are now going on strike. And now. <laughs> With all this news about the special effects department, Ooh. Jesus Christ! DVD it's not just DC. Yeah. It's not just Disney and Marvel. It's across the board. Mm-hmm. They have been working these people relentlessly, five plus hours a day. Well, not five plus hours, but five plus days a week, eleven hours a day, almost seven, pretty much seven days a week, just mm-hmm. to meet untimely deadlines. They were just talking about the several animators left across the spider verse because just the ungodly timelines they were being told to yeah. be with. Have, have you heard the news about Warner Brothers and Sony? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That was it's, bound to happen. It's, it's, it's stuff Wait, is folding. I missed that one. Stuff oh, is folding. Oh, go ahead. Tell them, Nick. Tell them. So, uh, Warner Brothers Discovery is looking to sail off half of its film and TV music catalog Including Batman. I Get think. the fuck out of here. Yo. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Seriously? We talk about the forbidden door in wrestling. Now the mouse is looking like it's almost time. It's, it's, <laughs> it's almost it's, time. It's, <laughs> door, it's, it's so bad. Opening. It's so bad. Like it's, not, star, it's time to come back. They're not selling off like the IP, like yeah. Their yeah. ability to make Batman stuff yes. move forward. The rights, yeah. He writes the whole kick to the boodle is up for grabs. They're yeah. not selling off like the IP. Like, like yeah. yep. their yeah. ability to make yeah. Batman See, stuff now, even, yep, you're right. Nonfiction even said yeah. he says yeah. they've been shrinking the number of writers oh. in the writer's room, too. So it's, yep. it's, it, they're, they taking hits. Mm-hmm. I, this, this strike is really starting to hit home. I think they're starting to see it. And all you can't put out, you can't pull out quality if you don't have the writer. But it's amazing that all they have to do is cut the check. That's it. You can literally solve this problem overnight. That's all they're asking for. They're not, it's not like they're asking for the, the, the moon and the sun and the stars. They just, it, that's it. it. That's all they're wanting. That's we, just all want, we, just want, we just want some tithing, just like y'all get tithing on Sunday. Y'all, get, y'all can still get the entire collection plate. We just want 20%. You still get 80 Give us our side. That's all we ask. Yeah, that's we we're not even asking for that much. It's crazy. So like, I wonder what a 10% cut for the people for the higher up people would amount to. If they took a 10% cut and gave these people that money. Well, you know the messed up part about that is Kira. Mm-hmm. I, I know I know what it is. I'm not the <laughs> <you know, laughs> you know is I wish those books were public. The yeah. what they make, because all you get all you get is just the what the quarterly calls and things of that nature are public. I wish we could get a whole accounting from places like Paramount or Warner Brothers or dare I say Disney, because mm-hmm. if that was made public and you found out how much executive shareholders were all making and then you get down to the writers and then uh, the, uh, 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 special effects artists, things of that nature, and you see how much they're making, there'd be fires all over Disneyland right now. Yeah. <laughs> I I truly honestly wrong. believe that not only will this strike change the landscape, but it's going to change the landscape across the board on everything. Mm-hmm. Yeah, like it once do, whatever right? negotiations is brought up, I think it's going to like going forward, whether it's uh, uh, big screen or streaming, it's changing the entire landscape. We may end up going back because we, as you've seen, June has been a heavy month for movie releases. We've gotten a movie every week, mm-hmm. every stinking re- week. We've gotten two movies at one point, which is why Elemental failed. It failed because it was like, where do you put it? You can't pick. You can't pick. (laughs) You just have to put a spot in it and say, we got to put it what we think might be the least, the weakest film. Mm -hmm. You know, it was, it's, what do you do? Listen, all I'm saying is this. The drought is coming soon. It is. The writer's strike will take out several publications it'll take out several studios and the consumers are going to want content 
Uh-huh. That is where we come in. Mm-hmm. Hi. Mm-hmm. We are here to entertain you. We are your we are your oasis in the desert. It's Indeed, we got you, boo. We got, we got you. you. Yeah. Because because if you if you know anything, wise. if if you know anything about this show, we know how to pivot. You got the you got the right <laughs> camp right here. Uh oh, she got nine. We pivot. Right right we don't put it in the chat. About, don't say it out loud. We, yeah, we don't just right. talk about movies and television. That's right. No, no. Type it in. Come on. <laughs> Make the face and type it in. Make the face. Because I'm, I'm pretty sure that be... Kermit the Frog. <laughs> <laughs> oh, anyway, don't, 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 don't put your hand down and move it because that, that looks like something else. That's, 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 that's for Blurred's Eye View After Dark. That's for Wow. Keep it above the microphone. Keep it above the I'll microphone. I'll put my head down Thank to pray. Much. Uh, so it's, 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 it's <laughs> like, like, like we said, the drought is real. It's coming. Mm-hmm. Um, Folks, this just generation that's not that has not that was not around for 07 or don't remember 07 because they were too young. Oh, I'm about to find out summer, real quick. Summer children, you did not, you did not know, you did not know the long winters before the before the summer. Mm-hmm. You know not what you stumble into. Just know that you're moving forward. It's <laughs> they're going they're gonna find out real. What's happening? This is the end. You just want to be petty and go first time. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you you haven't been here before. Oh, here, have a seat. Here, here, watch a little thing we called Lost. Uh, <laughs> wow. and, 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 and after you finish that, I guess you two to so called heroes. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> not, not, not. You must now know pain. You that must, was you that must was. I've suffered. You, you talking about being on a high, and then you get to that point, you just like, yo, what the what? What was it all for? <laughs> if 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 from sugar to shit was a show. Oh Whew. well, I will tell you wrong. What, <laughs> if if Chris and everybody is down with it, I will be the man on the ground in San Diego when I go to Comic Con and I can give you the scoop of how it's looking as far as the landscape of Hall H. Hey, we're down. Mm-hmm. Say hey, you are you gonna see Tracy out there? Mm-hmm. Tell her we said okay. hey. Nice. Do a pop in. <laughs> do tell do a pop in. Oh, that's our most our definitely girl, our girl on the West Coast, Tracy Carr. Crazy trick, crazy car out there. She's doing. She's that's doing the plan. Up. And Please I've seen up, there are a lot of people going. Uh, Grace is going to be there. Um, mm-hmm. I'm looking forward to just just seeing so many people and just it's a reunion for me because that con. It just oh. does something to your soul. I don't care who you Davey, are. Maybe I have Davey, I have a request for you when you get out there. <laughs> now I'm scared. What? <laughs> if you can get your hands on uh that copy of Victory that we talked about and, and, and get it signed by a certain cosplayer who's on that cover, you my man. <laughs> no, uh, pressure shout out, shout out man. Sh- shout out to Godhood Comics. Um Nick's just got the freaking trade. <laughs> I was trying to get it. I was trying to order it at work and I'm like, ah, I can't get it done. Stupid Wi-Fi at work. Uh, Yo, that, <laughs> is a, that is a beautifully crafted graphic novel. I um, yes, yes. They really took their time with the quality of the paper, the binding, the colors really popped, and oh my god, the story. Jesus Christ. It, it hooks you in. Like, seriously, if you, if, if for y'all you. in the room, or watching live on television on Arch Press Record. <laughs> if you have not read the antagonist, you, what are, you are doing, doing yourself a severe disservice. Yes. Yeah. And and you can't help but cheer it on. Yes, you can't <laughs> help it. It's, it's just it's, like I, I, I like this. I want some more of this. <laughs> I need this. <laughs> I need it in my veins. You're right, right. Wow. <laughs> you just you're just kind of like, mm, it tastes good. <laughs> I like it. Oh. Yo, shout out to the crew at Awesome Con. I mean, Black Folk with Comics came and showed out over that weekend. I wouldn't know anything about mm. that. They showed out. <laughs> and I was blessed because I got to meet, I got to work with Artway Alliance. Shout out to them cats for doing mm. that. And one of the uh, folks at the table was Jordan Clark as part of the Milestone Initiative. And he mm-hmm. signed my copy for me. Ooh. Nice. Mm-hmm. That's okay. Cause I'm gonna no. get great to sign my copy at BlurredCon. So, yeah. so 
So will Every, I. Everybody, everybody's showing up. You bet not. Showing out. Nah. You bet not. <laughs> Don't you want to? Everybody showing up and showing out. Like what the hell? It's gonna be a party. If y'all don't know anything out. about BlurCon, you need to listen to every last person up in here because folks okay. gonna be mm. showing up. I'm, I, I'm, I'm in the yes. It's gonna be a party. It's definitely it's gonna, gonna be a party. Um, I'm already mentally prepared. I'm trying to physically prepare for BlurCon because I already know what's going down. Yeah, you you never feel it until after you wake up the next morning. It's <laughs> oh what it's, day? It's, 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 yeah, right. <laughs> it's like, day, like it's just it's like when you because they were just like you're driving home, Chris. Yep. I don't know how. And it was like the whole the whole ride home six hours. Hmm. Sure. I miss it. Mm. Oh, I know. I need, Only six know. hours for where you are. Jesus. That's between you oh. and, me and the ship. <laughs> That's between you and ninety <laughs> miles an hour. <laughs> She's a trusty ship. She it's, got me through it all. It's all made of sea now. Bitching the whole right? way. I'm tired of you and your heavy ass foot. <laughs> She's, like, She's like, come on. I'm like, no, we do this together. No. Uh, <laughs> I, I, I know your negative was now. I'm like, that is not six hours. <laughs> <laughs> I push. I push through. I'm a, I'm a hustle. Uh, he push. Yes. He riding. He ride. Looking around. GPS is a beautiful thing. That's a fact. <laughs> mm. That waves app on. Okay, Thank right. you. Okay, I'm saying waves will let you know. It'll be like, oh, I'm like, cut it Popo. back. Mm. Cut that shit out. Mm. Pick up that foot. Yeah. Especially if you're on Arnold Swanson and he'd be like, uh, cops come in. Get down. <laughs> get down. Like, do it, get do it down. Down. Got it, got it. Get down. Get on the floor. Come on. So. I'm no, glad no. you mentioned Arnold because <laughs> if you have not seen Fubar on Netflix, damn, <laughs> mm. it's it's like it, it it's in the vein, it's in the vein of True Lies, it's in the vein oh. of True Lies, but it's a series, mm. and it's it, more and wrinkly. It, yeah, but it got renewed for a second season. Okay, uh, in Extraction Two. Jesus it was very well. Wait, is that I out? Seen it yet. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I, I didn't know it was out until wow. like Wednesday. Yeah. I heard it got greenlit for uh, a third it did. one. They're it got greenlit for a third one. I, when you're okay. you're sitting there like, yo. Because mm. that, that long tank? Yes. Yep. I, I would go back and watch that shit in theaters again. That's a good one. Like, you're right, you're right, you're right, you're right, Will. That's a that take they were the doing. When the long take was done, I wanted to throw money at the screen. <laughs> oh, wow. I needed to pay someone to allow me to watch that. That was oh, oh. I mean, it's a suggestion of that. Okay, so remember, I, everyone here has seen John Wick Four, correct? Mm -hmm. Say okay. what? John Wick Four. Yeah. Yeah. No. So remember yeah. the take they did, and it was an overhead shot, but it was like boom, 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 following from room to room. It's in that yes. vein of just oh. it, it, their uh, cinematography is coming such a long yeah. way. Cinematography is coming back, put that way. It's yeah, it's coming back. back. It's coming back, and it's strong. Uh, so yeah, it's yeah. <laughs> it's a, what's that? <laughs> Been waiting for someone dope to wrap yeah. the full bar, and in, in here you got it. Uh, <laughs> You're welcome. Yeah, full, full, full bar is fun. It's a, it's a fun film. Or a fun, uh, fun series. Uh, it's Arnold. Come on. <laughs> when you Arnold, came, when the, the king of one-liners, have you heard anybody else do one-liners like Arnold? No. You have to no. watch it. You're a damn good lady. <laughs> 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 I'm like, I'm like, they corny, but he's the king of them, and it works. You have to watch it. Yes. So, uh, we're going to take a quick break. Mm -hmm. When we come back, we're going to talk about the blackening first. I will fish through this one, that's for sure. Yes. So, stay tuned, people. Stay vigilant. Stay on point. Stay black. Stay black. I was going to say, somebody going to say it. Somebody <laughs> was going to say it. Black oh, damn. <laughs> yeah, he was saying, Nick, you beat me to it. <laughs> Blackness. <laughs> you got to you gotta, you gotta be a little brother fan to know that one. It, <laughs> now I'm about to go. Now I'm about to go go back and listen to their last album all over again. Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, we'll be right back. Hey, I was eating. What commercial? Hi there. 
this is a commercial break. This is your reminder to peep the podcast on all platforms and drop them a follow. And these are some more popular episodes that you can go ahead and check out after this one. Okay, I think I've bought them enough time for whatever they're doing behind me. Cut it, Chris. I'm going back to my damn sandwich. All right. Mm-hmm. Uh, <laughs> before, we, I'm going to do a quick round table. I'm going I'm I'm to do a quick round table uh, question. Okay. All right. 11. And these oh, are black questions. What, these are questions, questions that black folks know. You going to say the question that I died on? <laughs> Was it the Anvif question? <laughs> <laughs> no. All right. So we're going to make it easy. Because it's, it's plenty of them. It's more than we know. Uh, we'll start with Navy. Name one black person who survived a horror film. Mm. My ex-wife. <laughs> damn. God damn. God damn. We'll take it. Uh, sir, Are you the horror film? That was so stupid. I would like to know. <laughs> I can't. Wow. That was, that was so stupid. JK, JK, yep. JK. Sorry. Sorry. Christy knows. Sorry. Christy knows. The Chitlin Circuit. Yes. Um. <laughs> all right. Next. Uh, you know, I got to go with Love, Ella Cool J. You know what I'm saying? The only man who <laughs> two, two horror movies at the same time. There you know he is. Man? That's impressive. That was very impressive. <laughs> Don't do it again. Uh, cinematic assassin. <laughs> cinematic <laughs> assassin. Name one black person that survived a horror film. Buster. All right. Laney, Damn. you're a horror aficionado. Don't you steal mine. A lot of people don't remember you... him. Okay. I'm going to go Dwayne Martin scream too. Oh. A lot I of totally forgot about, about, about that. Exactly. Whew. Right. I totally favorite. forgot about that. I was like, please call me before Laney. <laughs> <laughs> Black Spartan. Uh, uh, Keith David, the thing. Okay. Okay. Yes. Woo! I almost didn't yes. make it. Laney took mine. <laughs> <laughs> Lady, oh, Lady Vandalore. Wow. Brandy. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> I'm always going to tried and true because even Chloe said it. Roger. Yeah, Roger set the whole thing off. Go back to our one of our Halloween episodes when we actually talked about who did that. So these were the type of questions that was asked in this beautiful film that mm-hmm. had me dying from beginning to end. The Black Man, uh, <laughs> great cast, funny premise. What would you do? If you were in a horror movie and your entire crew is black, who mm. dies first? Not it. The audience. <laughs> <laughs> now, we're, and here's the thing: we're not so much worried about the plot of the film. It, you know, it's it's a horror film. Most times, you don't really care about it. Group of friends go to that cabin. Killers, uh, killers lit loose, and there's a game that's being played. That's that. That's the added touch. Yeah. But my God, was this hilarious? I couldn't stop laughing. We, I was, me and my wife were sweat laughing. That's the thing. Apparently, we were sweat laughing. Like I said, oh, oh man, I just can't watch this in mixed company, man. I can't do it. <laughs> I, oh, it <laughs> no, was, that makes it even better. Uh, that's what made because uh, because yeah. like, you were showing like, out. What? You were like, like literally showing out. Like when they said this movie was designed mm-hmm. for black people to yell at the screen. That's an absolute. <laughs> there was a they couple times I did that. Mixed. They you weren't lying. Mixed. You missed out so much because Dude. I have never seen so many scared rice cake warriors. Don't know if they want to laugh or not. <laughs> and then look at me. And I'm just sitting there, just, I'm sitting there stone faced, like, I wish you would laugh. Because <laughs> <laughs> I know me, man. I know me. I'm 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 gonna I'm look over to my left and right and see one of them laughing a little too hard. And I can get yeah, right. I'm like, hey, what the fuck you laughing at? <laughs> like, like you know that I can see Nick's now. You bet not. You, you know that that not. was the case, like being no, no. In, in a black comedy club, and you know you 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 know you are gonna be watched depending on what you laugh at. Yeah, you already know. It's like, <laughs> <laughs> you know, so the dress cakes out there. there. You can't go see the black and then I'm not gonna see Matt Rife. Let's call it square. <laughs> <laughs> Flat out. Uh, the tropes were all there. Mm-hmm. The comedy definitely was all there. Every bit, the, the everything was there. The stereotypes, everything. And it just works. It was written well. It, it was for a Juneteenth weekend. 
which that was part of the reasons why they were getting together. Mm-hmm. Um, just really funny. Mm-hmm. It was, it was, you know how John Wick was the breath of fresh air we needed. So was this. Yeah. 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 So was mm-hmm. this, you know, because it's a it's a great premise. We never really thought about. We, I mean, it was joked about, you know, black people in a horror film. Nobody ever said if the whole crew was black. Yeah. <laughs> mm-hmm. The whole Probably crew. Shy. Now I you figure like who's the blackest? That means that's who died first. So, so let's ask this question here: In this crew, who would die first? In this crew, I think we drive the person who's trying to kill us crazy. <laughs> Cause they're just like, yeah, that, you know what? This this ain't this ain't it. I'm like, yeah, this this ain't it. This ain't this ain't what you want, man. This I'm telling you, this ain't what you want. Yeah, I want to fight. <laughs> I want to fight. All of them dudes that we're going to put in a circle, and then we got weapons, and that's it. Yeah, we're not going money. nowhere. Like, we're not switching I got, off. Like, I, want, I just want to talk. Just come that's outside. We just, just look, look, look. Here, let yeah. me discuss some things <laughs> with you. <laughs> next, who's a, no, next, who's I above need, you? Because I see what you're doing. Like, <laughs> who's what? Oh no, I'm Wait, sorry. Who's above you, next? <laughs> Navy. Uh, <laughs> Navy. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> no, Navy, no, Navy, Navy ain't going down. <laughs> it's, it's literally, it literally nah, is. See, it, it, I need that those... one to just kind of stand in the middle of the room, look at y'all, and go, Yeah, I see who's going to go first. So I'm going to just sit <laughs> over in the corner with my apple juice, and Man. whatever happens, happens. Apple juice. <laughs> like apple juice mm-hmm. out the box. Right. <laughs> see, that's why, you, that's why you're going to die because you're drinking juice. <laughs> <laughs> We drink, drink, man. We meant to, we meant to say gin and juice. Oh, okay, okay. y'all can, y'all can have gin and juice. I'm keeping my wits about me in the woods. Like, thank you. <laughs> that part. You a drunken monkey style. Come on, man. <laughs> there was, there was so many moments. Monkey, okay. no. yeah, yeah, was, yeah. There, no, no, no. Go with it. Go with it. There were, there were so drunk. many funny moments Blah. in this one. There was so many, there was so many standout moments in there, and it's stuff like that. Like, there's literally a scene because it's what. Yeah, it was about six of them, right? Six. I think it was six. six. Yeah. Yeah, it was six yeah, of them. Six. It was six of them. And they decide, okay, because the killer keeps locking the doors around the house remotely. So they don't know how to keep getting trapped in the rooms. And so when the doors get unlocked, the killer says, you have three minutes to either hide somewhere else in this house <laughs> or take your chances out in the woods in this dark it's nighttime already. And so they make the, the decision of what we shouldn't be doing. What black folks should not be doing. Don't split up. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so half of them stayed behind. The other half went outside. And you're sitting there in the theater. Every decision that's made, you're responding. You are clear. Clearly responding to everything that's being said, and you can't help it because it's just you can't help it. You're there. It's, it's not even five minutes into the movie, and you, you, uh, what is it? Um, Yvonne Orgy? Yeah, Yvonne Orgy <laughs> and Jay <laughs> Farrell. Yvonne Orgy and Jay Farrell. Just the first five minutes of that movie, you're already like, I know y'all, I know y'all ain't going the fucking there. <laughs> <laughs> Straight out the bat. Okay. And and I don't want to spend too much time on it because you know this other one we really gonna get into, but because it's not really spoiler with the blackening. It's Mm -hmm. if you know what it is going in, you know exactly Mm -hmm. what it is going in. Yeah. And you're taking everything. Everything. I think I'll give it a try. Oh, don't give it you you go. No, 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 no. Now you gotta go. No, 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 this is one of the it's ones not, where your, your black card is going to get pulled if you don't go see this movie. Which okay. is probably one of the questions. Oh. Uh, Fine, I'll go I'm, on I'm Sunday. I'm here with my whole life. I mean this. I can't have Fine, it. I'll go on Sunday. Good grief. You, <laughs> make it Saturday. Make it Saturday night. I got to mm-hmm. work. I got to deal with Yu-Gi-Oh players. So I need oh. something on Sunday to purge my brain. <laughs> oh. That will be it. People so you use Yu-Gi-Oh. That will be it. You're, and when I say you're, you're going to sit back and really question a lot of things, not so much about your blackness, but <laughs> Sorry. it's the it's the question about friends oh, that I God. that I actually got right. Mm. I couldn't remember the name. 
<laughs> he's shouting that, as he's running I, through the room. I actually got that answer. I actually got that answer right because I'm like Archer. Watch that shit, dude. Nah. That part, I thought it was only. I knew one. I, like, yeah, I thought it was only one. And when they started saying others, I was like, "Wait, what? <laughs> it was more than one." I said, "Okay." I was like, "I knew about I, Aisha Tyler, but I'm like, that, I don't watch that's it. it. That's that it. was the only one. That was the only one." It was like, but when they said, "Oh, those were the wrong answers," but I, the answer I actually originally had was like, "Yeah, Just, yeah." I, I don't I only know about that through news articles. Exactly. <laughs> Because like, it was she, she, was a, she was a big name, so yeah. it was like, oh, that's nice. I'm gonna go <laughs> there and watch uh, Khadijah and the crew. That's what I'm about to go to. Exactly. Mm. <laughs> wow. Which was also the answer. Which was <laughs> the answer. <laughs> that was the answer. The answer was all of those answers were wrong. The right answer was I don't watch that shit. I watch Living Single. That was the <laughs> answer. Because <laughs> I swear to God, that's what I was thinking. I was like, yo, there's only one, and I couldn't mm-hmm. even tell you. <laughs> that was it. So I just remember it was so it's, noteworthy. It was. It was, I was just like mm-hmm, me and the wife. Yep. Mm-hmm. Because we didn't watch this shit. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, it's 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 very much worthy of checking out. It is supporting black creatives, definitely black comedians and actors, and just we run. You know how we do. We run the thing. You know. Mm-hmm. I ain't seen a good horror movie. And normally I stay away from horror movies because it's you know thank God we got Lainey in the house because horse, I'll be getting disappointed. She watches horror films, so you don't have to. You don't have to. <laughs> <laughs> thank God for Lainey because I'm a little bitch when it comes to horror movies. Look, she's watched some of them, and I'm like, oh my, that poor soul. I would have never put myself through that pain because I can see Lainey's face like this is garbage. I'm, Oh no, that's exactly how I felt with um Jeepers Creepers <laughs> Reborn or some shit. Ooh. That's exactly how I felt with it. I didn't get past 10 minutes because I was like, yo, did what? Nah, I'm good. I was done with Jeepers Creepers at the first one when you realized you couldn't kill him. <laughs> well, that you part, you when you I, was curious, you kill I was curious. Him. I was curious. So I gotta it's, ask Lainey, what was the worst horror movie you ever saw that you actually watched all the way through? Oh, I, I bet you Chris know that one. <laughs> Uh, what was it called? The what was because, it called? The screamer? Or no, no, not the screamer. No. Um, oh God! It was about the clown. It had a, It was a clown. It, it, was, it, was, it was Art the Clown. It was Art the Clown. I yeah. Just, oh, yeah. um, um, the Tensure Fire. Terrifier. Fire. Yeah. The second one. Terrifier too. Terrifier. Yeah. That that was absolutely the worst fucking shit I've ever. <laughs> but, but if you see Winnie the Pooh, Blood and Honey. No. See, I've seen that. that was and I so think that, stupid. I think, that, I think. Thank you. That's stupid. But terrifying was even worse. See, yeah. of, all the, of all the stories they could have taken, Waldo was sitting right there. Waldo as a horror movie could have made money. That That's all I'm saying. Rock. That would because, rock. Because as soon as you found Waldo, he off you, and the legend just grew after that. Boom. That's a fact. That Don't worry, I love slap. you. Let me show you. Let me introduce you to my friends. I left that them a long time slap. ago. And they became raving lunatics. Actually, but they still much. love me. <laughs> a lot. That's why. What is it? Um, the writer strike. They need to come to you. You will. Yeah, I'm just saying. Just, just to will, see. Will. Just get Waldo. the right. Get the right person away. Play Waldo. Just be. Just be completely horrified, but don't say a word. But smile menacingly. <laughs> Bill Scar. <laughs> wow. Every time. That's all you hear. That's, that's easy. Scar Scar is easy. Try to think outside the box. I think like Will Ferrell, kind of. <laughs> New oh line. God! Did you say Will Ferrell? <laughs> I said we'll new go. lines. We'll so we'll go. Go. Get out of Waldo. here. That's inspired. It, Catch yeah. well, I can see the tagline. <laughs> if if Robin Williams, line. God rest his soul, was still alive, I put him for Waldo. Jesus. I he could pull that off. New he lines. Be funny and it. creepy at the same Where's time. Yes. Waldo? This I mean, time. He, he, he convinced me one hour. I am not a Will Ferrell fan. Sorry, I Will Ferrell is not funny to me. I agree. That man is not funny. Would be a freaky ass Waldo though. <laughs> Coming twenty. I guess all I can hear now is <laughs> where we Waldo? can do it. Back oh, he can do Waldo, though, I guess. Okay. This time he's oh, looking for you. This this is, not new line. He said not new line. <laughs> new, yeah, new line cinema. New line was known for that. Yeah. New line they cinema presents. Boy, they had the VHS game locked down with Man. the horror movies. Yes. Just as the puppet master. Good yeah. lord. But I mean, now, now it's Blumhouse. Yeah. And Blumhouse oh, they, is very hit and miss. 
Well, I'm, I'm about to say between what? Nightmare? Was Nightmare on Street in the last cinema? Yes. yes, it was. Okay, yeah, I was going to say Nightmare it's, on it's, Bloom, it's Bloom House and A24 starting A24, to, yes. Starting yeah. to get well, in that A24 room, too. is rocking. So, yeah. A24 is rocking consistently. Doing, Bloom House is very up and down. Yep, so mm -hmm. it's uh, go see the black. Do not disappoint so yourself. Don't don't lose your black card. You, you want to go see this, even even if you haven't seen it, and, and you're and you're the person oh, of, and you're the person of color. Um, but if, if you're going to question to yourself, why didn't I see this sooner? But if your boy says he voted for somebody twice, immediately he he gets thrown to the wolves. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> he gets immediately thrown to the wolves. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Which was the way, which is what the way is, they reacted was just so cool. Cause I was like, "Yep, that's that shit is real." Like, this that's, motherfucker, that's yeah, real. he voted for him not once, twice. If he told me, if he if he said it, told me he voted for him twice, I'd pull a shame from Walking Dead. He would call a legger. <laughs> 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 I'm sorry. Unfortunately, I do know one of those. <laughs> <That's sick. laughs> I think we all do. Yeah, all yeah. there's always one. It, make, it makes you look. You like. Yep. You lucky, Harriet, Harriet, Harriet was right. I'm saying, not here. <laughs> no, I'm like, I'm, me too. I'm like, who? Yo, no, I'm trying to keep it tighter. No, just because do, do, I, do I know no, no, them? No, no. I know, I them, know them. About to say the same thing that I think Chris was about to say. Like, knowing they them, know I mean, them friends like work. is some difference. Yeah. Nah, like, I, know them? Yeah, I, don't I know them. them. <laughs> I'm about, I'm about I don't hang out with them. You, so exactly. I'm stuck. Like that, I gotta, like, I gotta I see the memory. I, I gotta need, see the memory fan reunion. Yeah, I don't need oh. that energy in my circle. I can't. Mm -hmm. I can't rock like that. That is Couldn't a fact. Me? <laughs> Couldn't be me. He could not be me. It, it, it will come. It will pop off my lips every five minutes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> yo, your opinion don't matter. So, <laughs> so, uh, so yeah. Please check that out. Uh, you really need to peep that. Uh, yes, nonfiction speaks. Oh, talk to me. Another, Michelle Yeoh's in that one, isn't she? Talk to me trailer. I'm, about, yeah. I'm, I'm looking at it. I'm trying to look at scene. Yeah, I, I think didn't. Michelle Yeoh is in that oh. one. Yes, 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 she is. I she have missed is. this. What is what is oh, talk yeah. to me? Oh, no, okay. it, it actually it looks too. promising. Yeah, it looks like a, a, a imagine doing a Ouija board, but instead of a board. It's like a little like mannequin hand that you gotta dap up, and then oh, like, nerve, nerve you gotta hold out. it while everybody else in the room oh, is watching you talk to yes. it. Yes, so like yes. A a yes. like a monkey's paw. I have yeah. seen it. I have seen, like, it. but only literally that trailer maybe came out no. where I saw it about mm. maybe a week ago. Yes. I'm holding a yeah. monkey's paw over a Ouija board. It does look interesting. I don't I don't a monkey board. How would you do that? Either a monkey board or a Ouija board. I think it's. I think it's a hand. I think it's a real hand. At this point, just yeah. add yeah. the hand. At this yeah. point, just add the little trap thing from Hellraiser, and we're good. You've covered all bases at that point. It does. It, it's. How the fuck would you? Which, do that? which is funny because, even in the blackening, the one who voted for that person twice was like, "Well, I was using the Ouija board, and I'm sitting in the theater like, oh hell no, oh yeah, uh, yeah, we, we was no, all like, all right. no. <laughs> Red flags, <laughs> multitude. Mm -mm. What is that? That's a that's a, a Ouija hand <laughs> and a monkey I board. Take here, here, before we go on to the next one, here's a small detail about me and Ouija boards. When we were kids, me and my brother had stayed up. It was the movie channel, and it was late at night. Oh my gosh, I haven't heard those three words it, in it so the, long. The <laughs> and they were showing. Ouija board. That was the name of the movie. And mm. we did we really didn't know the name of it because you know oh, it was a little different than yeah, it was called Ouija. And we just so happened because my grandmother would always get like toys and stuff from secondhand stores and stuff because she had all these grandkids. So she just gets stuff and throw it in the garage for us to play with. My brother was like, Hey, and I'm like, Yeah, you like, did you know grandma had a Ouija board in the garage? <laughs> <laughs> Nigga. It was five. It was five in the morning. Oh, five. Yo, you gotta be kidding you listen, me, man. And that's you know what? Let me stop. We went outside. What? We was grabbing this thing with napkins and setting it up by the garage, and we tore that thing to hell. <laughs> we were throwing rocks at it and everything. We wasn't gonna be happy. So this thing was just in pieces. <laughs> Kill it with fire. Found grandma's demons napkin. And then kill it, it, kill it with fire. <laughs> and then, and then, and then my, my inventive ass, I done went and got like several trash bags. I put it in several trash bags. Not one. So it couldn't reform? You're right. <laughs> oh, yeah. 
these Negroes out here playing <laughs> office space with the damn Ouija board. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's a symbiote. <laughs> 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 we're not putting different bags. Hey, we're, not gonna tra- we're not gonna trash office space. Office space told me it was like, I don't really need this job. Uh <laughs> is this my red sleeper? Hey. <laughs> this is my red sleeper. <laughs> Didn't have my stapler. I got, I got, I got a pair. Oh. I got a pair. Make sure you can have a stapler black. It can be my stapler. Oh. Oh, no. <laughs> with fire. Oh, <laughs> oh no, nah, son. We, we, look, I Sorry. told a little. It took it took my mother to wake up. Like, cause we stayed in a quiet neighborhood. My grandmother stayed in a quiet neighborhood, so she was like, I kept hearing all this damn knocking. <laughs> mm-hmm. And she oh, see no. us walking back in at five forty-five in the morning, tired. Cause we didn't we sweating because we done we done rocked this thing. Yes. And we had to tell her. We were just like 45 oh, minutes. Kicking 45 up. minutes of destruction. Mm. <laughs> of life saving. That's what I call that's it. What, that's what it was. It was like you don't want to understand. Grandma, it, it, it was a it, it, it we had to do it was a purge. It was it was purge no ass. <laughs> this is like my brother, he went through the whole thing, and I was just like, Yep, that's how I went. I was the oldest. He like, I like that's exactly what we did. She looking at me. I'm like, "Yep, we tore it up. We tore it up." And she, all she could do was laugh. She's like, "What is wrong with y'all? We seen it was evil. We destroyed it. You're welcome. <laughs> uh, we are the heroes, Grandma. Now give us pop tarts. <laughs> give us pop tarts. We're going to bed. No, like, no. We will have pop tarts. <laughs> oh, we, but yeah, we'll uh, I, I've never seen another one in person after that, and choose not to." Uh, how, are they still in <laughs> how are they still in business? That's my only question. It's been decades, decades. Um, I got, I got two words. I got two words to answer that. African Americans, white people. <laughs> there right. you go. Right, white people. Let's get this. I, I'm about uh-huh. to say the caucasity. <laughs> the, the audacity of the caucasity. Like, the caucasiness. <laughs> the caucasiness. Because black Nikki, black Nikki, we would not do it. Yeah, blackly, exactly that term right there. <laughs> We was waiting to use that term again. <laughs> like they be all up in Target and Walmart just sitting on the shelf, and I be staring motherfuckerly like. You <laughs> <laughs> can do it like this. I be like, uh, uh-uh, uh, no, no. Next. I like that motherfucker. You know what would be fun? Not that. The uh, fuck, Staying away from your ass. That's what's fun. That's so you saying everybody staying the night at your house? I, I go ask my mom. I ain't gonna ask her nothing. I ain't <laughs> I will stay nah. at home. <laughs> so, nah. Laney, real quick. Have you ever yeah. heard of a horror movie that came out? Because when he mentioned Movie Channel, I remember seeing this on Cinemax years ago. Critters. Ooh, y'all told y'all age. Back tonight. when I was, my, ha- <laughs> my face was shiny because I had no hair. Um, it was called Evil Speak. Ooh. Now, okay. Yo. That's yeah. right. That no, one, I, that one was so damn campy, but it was so yes. wild, and I had nightmares for like six months after that. Listen, that was that was right. You are after feeding you are feeding my soul right now. Okay. <laughs> that was that was right after nine seven six evil. That's response. Yes! <laughs> I've heard of that one. I've heard of that one. Oh my gosh, yo! I forgot about that one too. <laughs> the video store was life on Fridays. I'm telling Man, you, videos, let's go. The video store was just, I mean. You got some of the craziest shit out of them. Things, Let's watch boy. this. What is this? Oh, <laughs> we have we have the exclusive of Mother Jugs and Speed. Yeah, I'm I'm, I'm, I'm good on that. Oh, I'm man. Good. Just keep <laughs> the damn horror movies. <laughs> All the Puppet Master movies got those from the <laughs> from the movie. Oh, Newcastle. God. They they was on one boy. God, man. No. <laughs> um, man. So. <laughs> Yeah, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. I hate you, Nick. <laughs> I hate you. <laughs> if y'all can see the chats, uh, <laughs> yeah, our back behind the stage chat is just it. ridiculous. Uh, Screenshot. So, so this next one, this this, you know what, this next Nick, movie. I agree. I was right there. Thank I you. was right there too. I ain't gonna lie. Yes, and part two. Yeah, I was there. Damn. Uh, uh, shit. Oh, that was 1981. Shit. Okay, I was one. The 80s, 80s, 80s was a different beast. It was a completely oh, different oh, beast. Okay. Oh, I yes. got one. I'm gonna put it in the chat. I'm gonna say it out loud. So, no. uh, sure. so another movie came out the same weekend. 
as the black angel. Oh, Jesus Christ. <sighs> For both things. <laughs> Jesus Christ, though. Oh. That a stretch for this. Breathe, one. just breathe. All right, here we go. Here we go. So, uh, <laughs> so Batman and Friends dropped over June 16th. Uh, <laughs> drop, drop, I love it. Operative word. Batman I love it. <laughs> <laughs> no, Michael Keaton and Associates. My, Michael Keaton. That sounds like the law firm. Michael Keaton and Associates. <laughs> <laughs> Michael Keaton and them niggas. <laughs> <laughs> no, but serious, Mike and them. <laughs> wow, yeah. he was so. Oh, I see. So blitzy froze. Oh, yeah. oh. It, it, um, <sighs> <laughs> for so many reasons. So here, so I'm gonna start off with some of the good that I, I could gather. There we go. Start with love. We, we start with some of the love. So you know. What were the pros and what were the cons? Pros the con was the money that was paid to go see the movie. That I did not pay full price. <laughs> <clears throat> she took the tram instead of the donkey. It's the same race. Mm -hmm. Um, the pros, the storyline is decent. It's not bad. It's definitely not bad. Uh, Ben Affleck had a nice, very, very good chase scene. I wish we got more of that. Michael Keaton mm. cooked. Standout performance. Let's go. Yeah. It's like right. he never I, missed a here. step. He never I missed a step. I was I was here for it from the, from the time they teased it. It was all Keaton. That it boy was, was salt. That boy was sauteing in the then that sauce ain't paying in the same <laughs> oh, oh. A little bit of flambe. <laughs> he was he was yeah, in was there. Cooking, cooking, you, boy. Patty, yo. <laughs> I Let's gotta grab get this out. Yeah. Grab out. <laughs> When I was saucy back in San Antonio. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh no! San Antonio, I, uh, really? I'm, I'm gonna start. We're gonna start with the pros. We start with Lady Mandalore. What were the pros for you? Um, Michael Keaton, 1989 Batman, 89 Bruce Wayne. Mm. <laughs> um. Free movie, comprehensive. Free, free movie ticket. Crazy. That's comprehensive. Yes. Crazy. Crazy. Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, Supergirl. Supergirl was she. She all right. She all right. Yeah. She she could have came back. She could have came back. I would have been. I would have been all right with that. A little bit. A little bit more her. Yeah. More more character development with that. One. Uh, I liked her. I did like her showing. I just yeah. wanted more from her. You know. Yeah. Uh, I feel like that. I mean, it was funny. It had some moments, definitely. To laugh at. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> mm. 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 Um. Yeah, that was good. It was all right. Yeah, that's it. That's my. Those are my pros. Those are my pros. Right. Are my pros. Black, yeah, Black Spartan. Black Spartan. What, what was your take? What was your pros? What was your pros? Ah, uh, Keaton. That's all I got. <laughs> <Damn. laughs> y'all yeah. heard. Y'all literally heard me in the chat. Well, Kira saw what I said. <laughs> Kira saw what I said in the chat. Uh, <laughs> that's it. it. I mean, it was, I mean, like y'all said, Keaton didn't miss a step. It was almost as if he stepped off Batman Returns was like, hey, I'm back 30 years later, but what's up? <laughs> didn't miss a beat. But that is the only bright spot of the movie. Right. Yeah. Montel. As a longtime comic book fan, I I had fun. I had fun with the movie. Um, of course, Michael Keaton, he came through like the boss that he is, reprising his role, making it look easy. Like he just bookmarked it from before, but he started getting stupid with Val Kilmer and George Clooney and all the other posers. Sorry. Sorry. I'm biased. Okay. Um, Sasha Kale as, as, as Kara. Nice surprise. Very nice surprise. I was actually pleased with what they did with her. Not too much, not too little. They didn't make her some whiny, emotional. She just like, nah, fuck you, and she just started just stomping into people. That's she what I want to see. Motherfucker in the moof. That's she what I want to see. She um, is not her cousin. No, nope. sure. <laughs> I like the concept of bringing in about Flashpoint without making it Flashpoint, kind of giving it its own life, and that to me made it say, so, okay, 
I see where they're going with this because they're not beating the same story in the head, although they're taking the premise, but they took it in a different in a different path that I didn't expect. Right. But overall, mm-hmm. it was a fun ride. I enjoyed it for for what it was. Mm-hmm. And and it was it it was it was great. So yeah, I'll, I'll bow my head and go back to sleep. Wake me up when it's my turn again. <laughs> uh, Nix, because I know the Flash is one of your favorites. Uh, I'm so th- this is how I, I my, my my pros for the movie. Um, of course, Keaton cooked like like he was he was he was salty. That man was in it. He was in, um, he was in it to win it. I Damn it, Bryce Barton. I did like the um, <laughs> the take they made with the Flash's mom and made her Spanish. That yeah, was it was different. Take. Yeah, I appreciated yeah. that that ethnicity change there. That was that was that was pretty good. Um, the Not emotions <laughs> they did they did capture the emotion pretty good. I mean, you know, as someone who has mourned the loss of people before, you would really do anything to get them back, regardless of what it would affect the universe. Mm-hmm. So mm-hmm. I definitely mm-hmm. felt that em- emotion part of it. Uh, the jokes, yeah, like 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 here said that they were good to laugh at. Mm-hmm. Um, <laughs> so uh, that was that. Uh, the fan service. <laughs> portion of the movie I thought was incredible Mm -hmm. but I've said before it was like watching a great gymnastics routine and then the landing was just not stuck at all yeah cinematic assassin um all that stuff y'all said Keaton of course (laughs) Uh, <laughs> Sasha really liked her turn. Um, I got, I guess I gotta be the one to say it. Ezra Miller did a great job with the dual role situation. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Why you take mine? No Why way. you take no mine? Way. Ain't no way, ain't no way. No, I agree with that. I was, that's what I was gonna say. Mm, I agree with that. Let him cook, let him cook. He's let him cook. He yeah. took what I was going to say. is ready around. to come through the He's screen, y'all. Y'all going to see my face. Y'all going to see my Karen face. Is. I'm going to go on mute. But I agree with Will. I'm just saying, like, to to have an entire movie on your back, essentially, and you have to give us two distinct characters yes. that, that felt distinct the entire time, <laughs> and... <laughs> To, to 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 have to be as annoying as young Barry had to be to make us like not hate old or original recipe Barry as much. Original recipe. <laughs> and then like Nix was saying, they really delivered on the emotional notes, especially with the mom throughout and especially at the end. It's like yeah. I you know. I feel like I came into the film, much like a lot of people, with my personal feelings about, um, you know, real life reverse flash. But upon watching the 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 situation, it's like did a good job. Oh, you mean not a like, bad actor at all. Like can't can't knock the hustle. Yeah. All the shit you did in Hawaii, like don't don't do that no more. Sit down somewhere. But like the oh, actual the product on the screen. I, I it was a Laney. No, I, I, I yo Will took everything I was gonna say because for me like one of the best thing I'm gonna go backwards and go forwards and and cross to Marvel for a second but for me one of the best things about the first Spider Man Sam Raimi Spider Man was watching William Defoe in that mirror. When he does that, like, mm. I'm going to be Green Goblin, then I'm going to be me. Like, yo, that shit was just great. I love seeing actors who can do things like that, right? So, like, when Ezra, and, and don't get me wrong, because when we talk about cons, I'm probably going to say something very similar to what I'm saying as a pro. To Will's point, you have an actor that is carrying two distinct, mm-hmm. very different, mm-hmm. okay, um, emotions, very different portrayals of one personality. That is crazy to me. And I love seeing that. And I honestly think for that reason, he did a good job. And I'm, I'm like I said, I'm just going to echo what Nick said and what Will said. 
from personal experience, that third, when when he went back to kind of like just have that apology, that broke me. That actually broke me in the Flash um, series mm-hmm. when they did the same kind of thing in that fun on in that finale. That broke me because I felt that. You mm-hmm. know what I'm saying? But yeah, that's that's it. I mean, y'all said Keaton, so I can't say that too. Yes, you can. Say it. Say it. Say it. Say it. Oh, thank, thank you, obviously. Thank you. Go, say go it. Ahead, go ahead. Go, go, go ahead, right, Carrie. Go ahead. Wait, I got one more positive. One more positive. One more positive. Because I didn't keep all the way up with the Flash show because I couldn't do it. But <laughs> I, I swear for Lord, I'll be telling it's the right. these regular ass folks I know, like, the Flash can get busy. Like, y'all don't understand. Like, my man can just walk through solid walls. It's like, yeah. no, he can't. Like, yes, he can. You, you can phase your yes. chest and stop your heart whenever you feel like it, son. Yeah. So the fact that Faith was in the film, I was very appreciative. I, I, I relinquished the floor. Okay. Okay. I, um, I, 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 real quick, can, can I say something real quick? I, 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 was, I wasn't going to say anything about the dual portrayal, but you got to give it to Ezra Miller. He had a really big job, and I think mm-hmm. portrayal of not only two characters at two different ages, and still trying to make it look distinctive, it's not easy. We've seen people try to portray that before, and guess what? It was ass on a cracker, and I never wanted to watch the movie ever. But again. at the same time, though, I mean, we we've seen other actors Thank capture you, capture yeah. duality way better than what he did. Don't well, get me wrong; it I wasn't mean, whack. Okay, I, I have seen actors uh, capture duality way better than what Ezra. That's did. true, I, but I, I we can't that. compare them him to his performance to others because they're not the same caliber of actors. But I kind of want to because no, Logan, that's not. No, 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 I'm, I'm gonna tell you why. I'm gonna tell you why. Is Kim uh, sipping tea? The, the movie's uh, <laughs> uh, uh, James James Avery, the guy in Split. The mm. man gave. Multiple different. Oh, James, James. Oh, McAvoy, McAvoy, McAvoy. Yeah. Apologize, McAvoy. Like, I'm like, wait a minute. Hey, he passed. I don't remember that movie. Hey, he passed on. Damn, I You bringing zombies back from the dead and judging? I don't know. Uncle Bill's a great man, Uncle Bill's a great man, but let me let me still get this point across. The man did duality in like eleven different people. Believable horror movie. Still believe this one. Still believe this one of my top ten. Uh, Reverse Flash Good basically talking mm, to himself, and, and also multiplicity. Thank I you. I forgot Nonfiction. about multiplicity. Multiplicity is also a good one too. What's but your the name? Point I make it is Steve. it's just that here's the reason why I say it wasn't believable because it got to the point to where where your best friend is yourself in the movie, and that <laughs> you literally had a. You had a not an angel and devil situation, but you literally had two sides of the brain basically talking to each other for two hours out of the movie. It was campy, it didn't work at times, it felt borderline creepy. That's why I'm saying, that's why I'm saying I can't give the man credit because number one, if you're going to if you're going to basically create a paradox by talking to yourself in the current timeline and yet not destroying the universe. You basically just crapped on what makes the Flash great. I said it. Lady Mandalore? What? Y'all know he wasn't in 80% of that movie, right? Y'all know he wasn't. I mean, I'm, and I'm, I, I know y'all gonna say, what are you talking about? Let me tell you what my young eyes see. There we <clears> go, <throat> ladies and gentlemen. Get your notepads. I went to go see this movie in IMAX initially. Chris, you, I told you. Yeah, I think we, I, we, talk, we, talk, talk, yeah we talked about it. We talked about it. I thought, you know, big screen, you know, 10 story foot uh, images, da 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 da. Didn't notice anything. Didn't notice anything. I went to a regular digital ass screen, not even the next day. Almost every single scene that he is in is a CGI copy of him. He is not in those scenes. There are not two people. He did not film one portion and then go to the other. Those were computer generated images. I'm not, I'm not. I have never yeah, been they have so sure of something in my in. entire life. He You're was gonna make not me go broke together on a Sunday. with himself. I see how this going to work. You can make my ass go broke on a Sunday to go see this shit again. I yes. promise. You're, you're like, <laughs> you give me my money had, back at Blur's time. That's all I got to say. There's a he had scene. a stand-in. There, he has a stand-in. He, he, does, he, does. he does have a stand-in. But he's still not even... The stand-in is just CGI'd over. 
Mm -hmm. There is a scene where it's the two of them. One of them's in the foreground. The other one's in the background. I think the one in the foreground, you see stroke face in the CGI. Why does it sound like the name of... That's what you call a villain. He says a new villain, Stroke Face. It's tro- it is. Yeah, stroke His, face. What are we it's, talking it's, about? Uh, if you're looking at the screen, if you're yeah. looking at him on the screen, it's the right side of his well, face. What are we talking about, though? Are we talking about the FX that weren't done? Or are we I'm talking, talking about, about him? Thank you. And that's what I wanted to say to Will. To, to Will's guy, the Black Swan's yeah. thought you, you process. Can you, we, we can fight. I'll see you in a couple weeks. That's <laughs> <laughs> <Lord>. <laughs> Lord, the family reunion is about to get real. But you, you can go see this movie again, Will. And then when I break your heart because I told what, you the do truth, I have I don't to referee a fight at Blurcon. I am not but down for this. No, 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 <laughs> no, so here's the thing. Here's, here's the thing. I love you. <laughs> here's so the reasons for its failure. Now, Screen Rant has 15 of the biggest factors that could be the for the it's it's a historic bomb. It should have been in reverse. I saw the, it. I saw it, the fucking list. You seen it? Yeah. It, yeah. You're right, Nick. I'm with you. It's tough at the box office. No, it is not. That's a cop out. You just we want well writing done for stories. You just we just don't want stuff thrown at us. Mm-hmm. We were here. We are here for John Wick. We are here for Volume Three of Guardians. We and are me, here for these stories. Here's another reason why it's a cop out. Oh. Because you have to remember the audience you're catering to, and we are comic book fans. And nothing against any other fandom, but comic book fans are some of the smartest fans mm-hmm. that are out there. And right. most and rabbits. you and you can't just throw Ain't shit that. to a wall and expect for it to stick for us because we're gonna dissect that shit not only canonically, Green Lantern like source material, we're gonna dissect it by cinematography because we've seen what bullshit looks like before, Green Lantern, and, what can, and how great it can be now. Exactly. Green Lantern. So you nah the, to that yeah that was a big ass cop out. Yeah, that which that leads comic book fans off completely, which leads to number two. Superhero fatigue is real, sort yeah. of. Yeah. No, it's not. No, it's not. That's bullshit. That's bullshit. Spider Man Across the Spider Verse <laughs> is looking at a possibly making a billion dollars. Listen, James that's Cameron, if you wrote this list, just come forward. If, if James that's Cameron what, wrote this list, just come forward. Because a lot of a lot of what was on this list, I don't agree with. Mm-mm. Uh the best superhero movie ever, which was the narrative they were going with, didn't work. That's true. They yeah. kept the hype train on this thing was so big. Yeah, they made it seem like this was the thing that was going to change this landscape, and mm-hmm. it didn't. I'm gonna have to hop at not Jim, all Jimmy G. But, but and even that, la- even that last scene could have. Yeah, it, that it last could've. scene. You, you really yeah. wait, you, there were scenes so, the way wait. the way that they said that the scene was supposed to end was actually not about George Clooney. It was supposed to be that he didn't even know what was happening, and then that could go into the new DCU. The new DCU. Okay. You see what I'm saying? The okay. fact that they 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 just fan service that last scene, yeah. which made no sense. No, yeah. right. because if you're going for it, you turn it into an Elseworlds type situation. Because yeah. what I you want to know what I took from that? I'm like, okay, Barry, you fucked up the timeline. You're mm-hmm. trapped. Yeah, you're fucking, trapped. and that and that could have been intriguing. Yeah, yeah. that you're could have been done. intriguing. So mm. now mm. number number four really? is James Gunn's DCU makes the whole thing moot. This is true. True. I agree with mm. that. Or or, or, is, or we could throw it in a submarine. Stop! 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 stop, stop. 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 We, we gonna we gonna do this <laughs> <laughs> now. We gonna do stop. this? Sir? Really? <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna put myself in timeout so I don't Will. have to leave. I can't put you in timeout. I'm right behind you. Right behind when, you. when they go low, we go high, William. Yes. Wow. <laughs> All I have is <laughs> oh, 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 supposed to go high. Oh, there we go. No. You can't oh, hear, you can't see me, but you can hear my shame. That was a good one. That, that was, was a good one. That was, that was a good one. <laughs> um, so good. number five that is confusion and conflict with the CW. No, there's no confusion. No, no there's no again, conflict. We're smarter than that. <laughs> yeah, 
We just what? didn't like the fact that you used that the CW was using Barry Allen, and then here you go using Barry Allen for the live I action mean, for the I film. Mean. It didn't you you got Wally West. You could have done it. You could have I don't know why you didn't, but you could have done. Uh incredibly tight limitations of the multiverse. Mm. Limitations. It's the multiverse. No, no, it? Yo. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, Kira. Like, wow. <laughs> <laughs> Eric Mind almost you, exploded this, on screen. This this is not our yeah. list. Let's put that out there. This is a list from Screen Rant. So this is not our list. Um, the nostalgia does nothing. Wrong. You gave us Keaton. Perfect point, in fact. <laughs> During that battlefield scene, and he kept trying to bring everything back. The other bear kept trying to bring it back. He's like, I can bring you back. What does, what does Batman say? That's okay. You already did. I read that as We've been wanting him back for for so long, and we got him back. Exactly. That last comment. It's the multiverse. There are no fucking limitations. Exactly. That's it. Exactly. Mm-hmm. That. So tell me you don't know nothing about what you're doing without telling me you don't know nothing about <laughs> what you're doing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah exactly. It don't so, <sighs> Oh no, I don't know. Yeah, they wrote this screen rant wrote this article. Green rant is not what yeah, it used it, to be. Can, yeah, can, it's, it's, can I also comment on the the trope of the yes, <laughs> the Irish their, West being list. black? This is their list. Wait, why is it got to be a trope? <laughs> <laughs> they Wait. literally copied it from the CW. Like Iris West, oh. when we first d- discovered her. She was she was the caucasity of caucasity. Okay. And then he put her on the CW. Guess what? This chick got a tan and an attitude. To, to that, to that, I'll say this. And was fine. With, when the when the new fifty two rebooted, we did get a I wouldn't say black, but she's definitely not white Irish indigenous. West. How about that? Yeah. 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 So she, she she's definitely not white. So I think she's Filipina we, we did, we took a page out of that book, and <laughs> we got uh, the lovely Candace. Now, mm-hmm. personally, that the CWs. I'm, 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 just, let me let me, cook. Let, cook. Let, let me cook. Let me cook. Let me cook. <laughs> We got a bigger we, spoon because yes, <laughs> staring kind of slow. Use the big spoon. <laughs> we got a we, we got a sexy Candace in the CW, but oh, this Candace oh. we kept it in that same vein, and she was cute, mm-hmm. very cute. But mm-hmm. when you think about how the social material changed the new fifty two, it's on par. Yeah, yeah. Mm. Uh, number eight, the Flash is super long lead marketing. This yep. thing's been cooking for like five years. What they talk yeah. about lead marketing? Just say it. That's they, not a lead marketing. They, they, that's they, delayed they, as fuck. That's <laughs> not a lead marketing. It was pushed back mm-hmm. three fucking times. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It was supposed to come out last year. Um, <laughs> Flashpoint for a lesser proven flash. Mm. Yeah, yeah, I guess you I mean, get some side of things. Uh, audiences, audience don't love this version of the DC universe. Uh, that's kind of on par. Yeah, because they've been used to the CW. CW was a literal proper introduction for a lot of people. Yeah. And when you go to the cinematic side, now you've switched from this cast that people have come to know and love Mm -hmm. to this cast that you've had to remanufacture. Yeah. I can tell you this. I'm from, I live in Norfolk where Grant Gustin, I knew him as a kid. Cause he used to come to my job and play Yu Gi Oh. Is this a light flex? Wow. No, 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 but what I'm saying is because when we found out that he was going to be the Flash in the CW, we were proud because I knew he was going to be talented, but at the same time, that dog got it. I'm a talent for a different reason. Uh huh. The time is damn near perfect. <laughs> but when we knew the Flash movie was coming out, the first thing I said is Grant would be perfect because everybody's used to his portrayal as Barry. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. So uh, I'm gonna switch their listing up because I actually agree with this number eleven. So I'm gonna move it. Uh, they said the writer strike hurt wider promotion. No, that's no, not didn't. Who did it. That the ain't movie was not. fucking done. Yeah, y'all had mm-hmm. four years. You had yeah. four years. This what list is, is it? Y'all had too much time or not trash. enough? <laughs> <laughs> this list is trash. It's a, it's a trash list they came up with. This list is trash. I, I, I probably, I probably agree with a third of what's on this list. They said the press tour was weakened by no. <laughs> no, it wasn't. 
No, it wasn't. And I think it made it stronger, actually. Yeah. 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 Did, he said the press tour was weakened by no Ezra Miller or what Michael stop? Keaton. <laughs> they were at the fucking red carpet. Well, that, I'm was like, the, look. that was the options. That was the options at the movie theater. I, 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 me and me and Chris said it before. They only had three options. It was either one, you were going to hide the crap out of Ezra Miller until the movie popped up. Two, you were going to promote him but give him very limited, very limited exposure. Or three, you're going to let him go out there and do every interview and question and whatnot. And this is after all the mess he did. All they did yeah. was just take option number one. They took the lesser known or the, the 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 least of their issues and used it. Now these reasons I agree with the Ezra Miller controversies. That was his what, tour. That that was that was his tour. Yeah. <laughs> that that was an issue because I went in thinking if you wasn't such a trash person. The only problem you would have had, which is what another one I agree with, agree with, the bad CGI narrative. Now, there were scenes that worked fine. But that scene they did when he's in the, the chrono ball, that's what I call it, the chrono ball. And they start showing certain scenes. <laughs> the hamster ball. <laughs> right. <laughs> there is a, literally a, a scene they have when they show uh, kal punching him from Justice League when they brought him back from the dead. Mm -hmm. I'm like, why would you CGI that when you could have easily took that clip and slapped it? You could have CGI the rest where you don't really see it, but you mm -hmm. could have put that clip right there and just copy paste. It's not mm -hmm. that hard. Mm -hmm. You got the scene, you got a scene where he sees both his parents as when he's coming into that new timeline and they show his parents celebrating his 18th birthday and everything else. You had the actors there. Why did you need to CGI that? As much as I love DC, Warner Brothers is in a toxic relationship with my baby, and she needs to get out. You're going to be the Shamar Moore with the braids, huh? Shamar Moore <laughs> with the braids. Shamar. She needs to have this relationship with this nigga. Look, so... <laughs> so... This is this is what it is. This is what it, we know what we were here for. We got what we were here for, right? Right. It was Wait, Will, Will, what were you gonna say, Will? You had your hand up and everything. Wait, you what were you gonna say? I didn't get what, what I was gonna say. No, I was gonna say, like, I read about the bad CGI before I saw the movie. Mm -hmm. And I saw mm -hmm. the director was just like, Oh no, it's supposed to look like that. I was like, mm, come on, son. I <laughs> genuinely believe. That the 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 chrono bowl that was an artistic choice. Now them damn yeah. flying babies and the dog, the baby shower scene. Yeah, that was that horrible. Was that was that horrible. Was horrible. Was like, look, look, the dog, the dog <laughs> looked better. The, the dog looked better than the babies. I mean, I'm just, right? Yeah, the, I mean, the, the babies Warner was Brothers, hot shit. With yeah. Warner Brothers budget, this is what y'all do. Like we didn't need the close Facts. up. Like as long as you didn't do close up of babies' faces, you were okay. But the minute you caught a close up, I'm like, that shit looks weird. This mm -hmm. is probably why DC will not be there because you know if they get Hall H, that line for questions is going to be ridiculous. Probably smart on yeah. that on their part. <laughs> ridiculous. Like, probably smart. So in an article that was written for I want to say superhero, like, Zach Mulligan, who was one of the VFX artists who worked on the movie, explained the reasons behind the poor CGI. He says in a video he posted on his TikTok, he described how the VA VFX this. companies yep, are hard, but hired by Marvel and Warner Brothers. It's a bidding game. They put it, And we talked about it earlier on here. They're under these insane amount of stress to meet these deadlines. Uh, they need the sequence. He says, if it looks like that was made in a week. It probably was. Because it, it was, was made in a week. Or less, probably. Mm. They have they have to they state how many shots they need for a sequence and the VFX studios places the bids to work on the film, the workload and each shot varies, yet it's still considered one shot in the total quantity. Because yeah, of this, the VFX yeah. artists are forced to work relentless hours over time mm -hmm. almost every day, including weekends. These cats is overworked, man. And it's crazy how they layered that because he said like one shot could be just, you know, uh a race in a wire or something. Yeah, yeah. but then yeah. another shot could be that plus a, a color change or you know fire fire. Yeah, it's like yeah, that's crazy to me. Yeah, 
but it's it amazing could. what we're finding out now about behind the scenes work. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You know, from the writers to VFX artists to the, 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 not the but, producers. But that just adds more to this whole thing about why they're striking. It's mm-hmm. like, mm-hmm. About it, it's like we were kind of, and not to throw it back to Marvel, but yes, for a good long time, we were in, we were lost in the sauce of Marvel. We loved every movie up until a certain point, which all of them were coming out. We all thought them were great. We didn't see the underlying issue of, of artists, writers, graphic designers, all being put under these crazy ass Amazon-like deadlines. Hmm. So it's only now that, you know, as we're going through it, that you see, especially on the DC side, again, with a budget, because it should be similar to the mouse, this is what you wind up with. And then the director, I know we already covered that, saying, well, this is how the Flash would see it. No, that's weak sauce. You gonna sit, yeah. you gonna sit there and tell us something like, oh, well, this they, how the they put this, they put that man under the gun for that one. I, I yeah. said that's I was like that was a that was a bitch made move. I'm sorry, that's just what that was. But you know, and, and they made him do that. But I, <laughs> I know thing, he don't believe that. I know it, he don't believe that. Here's my thing: if you're the director and you're now about to go do Star Wars, you've already got you've already gotten to go ahead and do Star Wars. You and I was here, Chris. <laughs> oh, 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 I'm the only one concerned. I, I'm the only brother concerned. No, we, we, we're not. We're not. We're not. We're not, we not, we not speaking. I feel like Clinton in the black and I'm the only one concerned right now. Oh my god! I'm sorry. The black person right you're trying to reach is no longer in service. <laughs> If you feel a Reese's Negro in error, please hang up and try your word again. <laughs> so here it is. So speaking of the director, he said, you know, we we seen the nostalgia did not hurt this film. It actually helped. Mm-hmm. Where yeah, it hurt at, great. yeah, what, what it where it hurt was how it looked. Mm-hmm. So we're talking about, like he says, Nicolas Cage. That wasn't a CGI scene. They actually shot a scene with Nicolas Cage because he was supposed to do Superman back in the 90s. Yeah. And Superman lives. And, but you still, that's still CGI. Like you could tell, you can clearly tell, like, yeah, you did shots. The mm-hmm. Christopher Reeve and the Helen Slater shot. Mm-hmm. Nice nods, but they stay, you know, the fact that you, CGI. yeah, like you could have brought it in and then been done with it, but it was focused so hard on their faces mm-hmm. that you notice it. You know, uh, who else was it? We to this day, they I thought that was Teddy Steers, Teddy Sears from the t- TV show Flash as Jay Garrick. Yeah, mm-hmm. that looked like Teddy Sears. Was- Teddy Sears has said himself that wasn't him. Mm-hmm. And I'm like, well, don't tell me that was John Wesley ship as Jay Garrett because it, sure it wasn't because it didn't look like that. Right. So I don't know who that was supposed to be. That's, that's, that whole that whole piece was fumbled. Yeah. yeah. Like so, visual, I mean, other but, other than the Adam West and and Cesar Romar, Romero being the Joker and Batman, and, and you really see it. You hear the voices and you see the chase. They mm-hmm. they took a scene. And they put it in there, and it wasn't even CGI. It was like, that's what you do. You do that. Why couldn't you do yeah. that? They ran out of time. And I don't know yeah. how they ran out of time. Mm. My biggest, Or they ran out of money. Four the, years. My biggest problem with this whole movie was this. Is that The Flash, when we first heard the movie was coming out, the premise stated that it was supposed to be loosely based. On Flash? <laughs> Yeah, it was. And with all the bullshit. Diarrhea loose. With all all the bullshit that occurred with Ezra Miller. Tighten it up. (laughs) No, she right. She right. She right. (laughs) With all the bullshit that happened with Ezra Miller and with all the crazy shit that happened with the DCEU and how it it fails, Mm -hmm. this was the perfect time to use this movie to stay in that same vein and give us the reset button that we should have gotten. Agreed. Mm-hmm. Agreed. And we did not get that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And that's what pissed me off more than anything, because this could have been the perfect time to reset everything to make way for James Gunn's vision to start coming to fruition. Fair. We could have got introduced to new faces and new characters. 
We could have got we could have got the fucking letter scene, which I I was praying we got, oh, but we didn't get that. We were, we were gonna get that. As my, so I, I know the letter scene, I'm agreeing with you next, but we yeah. were gonna get that as much as 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 hard hitting as the letter scene would have been, we were not gonna get that. As, as someone that is not of the Church of DC, would you please <laughs> explain? So okay, so the letter scene that they're speaking of is in Flashpoint, mm-hmm. where 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 Thomas Wayne has written a note. I've heard of this. And and Barry takes it mm-hmm. back to his regular timeline and mm-hmm. gives it to Bruce. Mm-hmm. And this is one of the times we see Bruce shed a tear. Man, bald like a baby. Yeah. I, wait, didn't they? But they did it in the animated series, right? They did it in yeah, the they animated. did it in the animated. Right, yeah, they did it in Flashpoint Paradox, but they didn't. Yeah. They 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 had the opportunity to do it in the movie. Mm-hmm. Not only did they fumble the ball, they stuck a screwdriver through it and tossed it in the trash. And see now, and this yeah. is, this is and, then, and here and here's another cop out. Yeah, that scene. That, that scene. scene. Yeah. And here's another cop out. They were banking everything. They said, "Oh, we had a Batman and Beyond in the can, and it depended on the success of the Flash." No, it didn't. You didn't. You didn't. You didn't need that. You didn't need that. No, I agree. You don't. You don't need that. There hasn't. There hasn't been one person that I've heard or talk about that's talked about this movie that was saying, "Oh, I don't want to see Keaton." Fuck that. Everybody wanted to see Keaton. That's all mm-hmm. anybody's been talking about. And to see about. him as grumpy old mm-hmm. Bruce and Batman. Was like, we oh, that, that could have worked. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like, we that could have worked as hard long body. as you brought him back, that's all we cared about. Pretty yeah. much. Honestly, we were going to get Keaton and Batgirl. I'd rather have seen that and shit. Was, mm, that the plan part. that they had, he was supposed that to be part. like the Nick Fury of their, of their world going forward. He was yeah. going to be the one that kind of bring everybody together and bring this in now. All this shit done unfolded. Somebody over there with the the money that WB is bleeding right now. Mm-hmm. Somebody leaked that back, girl. Somebody, somebody got it. They need somebody, to. Somebody, somebody got should, it. Somebody should just open the door to the vault. There, 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 there are it. there are there are seven different podcasts and channels in this chat right now. Give it to one of us. <laughs> right. Listen, it's, that it's, part. It's or all of the above. That's that wildfire. Because it's gonna be it's gonna be a mass text. I'm like, did you get it? Yep, got it. All right. And mm-hmm. if you give it, and if you give it, I'm about to say, join me. Nobody in this house. It is male male exclusively. No, no, no. We literally tell you what. That's what. That's gonna be the. That's gonna be the first Patreon. Five dollars. That's all we looking for. It's five dollars. CD ROM. I'm on it. They gonna I'm come. A, I'm gonna handle the money. Put it on CD ROM. Okay, there you go. <laughs> CD ROM. No, 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 no. Hey, you are showing it. You are showing it. I won't be living this. Now, 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 DVD ROM. DVD ROM. Yeah. <laughs> So now fix this. How do you guys feel about how do you feel <laughs> to wire. know that since the flash is bomb that a Keaton Batman beyond more than likely won't happen now? I was never gonna happen. It was never gonna happen. It was never gonna happen. This is this is this is yeah, it's just them talking because fans made this happen. Shut up, Nick. Fans was talking this. They they wanted that. That's how you should do it. That's how you should do it. That's exactly how you should do it. Yo, kid, that would be phenomenal. That is absolutely fucking. What you say, Nick? What you say, Nick? You gotta say that. You gotta say that. I gotta say that. So so Nick so Nick Nick was in our private chat. He says, I'ma hide it on Pornhub. So Genius. Oh, that's boom. Fairly that's genius. 173, page 173, 75, somewhere in there. Just put it on oh. dark guacamole. Nobody will see it coming. <laughs> put it on X Hamster. Nobody will watch it. Nobody will right. <laughs> So we know what you guys do. Look. <laughs> You and the wives. Oh, we chronicle, <laughs> we chronicle you... adventures. <laughs> what you we doing? It ain't what you think, baby. It ain't what you think. It's a script. It's he like said, it's. He said. He said. Was on I'm reading the review. It's, it's it's a great cover. It's a great cover because you know guys get caught. I'm like it ain't what you think. It's like it's, you know, Wait, it's a script. I like it for the. I like it for the video. Next, <laughs> next. It looks like you're typing. How I would do it, because you know, <laughs> what's the first appearance of Batgirl? So I might somehow, you know, 
hide it within some sort of a code. Just, Maybe just say, just say Frey Ed. <laughs> just say Frey Cowgirl. Ah, she yeah. appeared in Tech the Comics three fifty nine. So I would hide on page three fifty nine. Three fifty nine. It's all. It's all. It's all in the details. It's all, it's the all details. in the details. You so have to know your history to find. We out. we we were never going to get a Batman Beyond. We no. wanted one because let's face it, Keaton is at that age yeah. that he could have played an old Bruce. He's done it already. Mm-hmm. It's shown Bruce. He his showed Bruce. Is exactly yeah, the, the dark, way him as a dark knight. His hair is, is exactly the dark knight would have been perfect. Yeah. That would have yeah. been fucking perfect. Is it was there? So we're never going to get a Batman Beyond. We know what the hangups are, were with this film, and one of the major hangups is Ezra Miller. The other one is the CGI. And you can tell now. And now that the stories are coming out about the VFX departments getting just basically bogarted and forced to finish under these crazy deadlines, now we really know. And it's just, it's unfair to the fans. It's unfair to them, you know, to me, such a demand. And the fact that you had five years. Mm hmm. You know, you say, oh, we're done completing it. We're just doing some reshoots. Okay. Now what? When this shit was going down, it happened, what, during COVID? Mm-hmm. You know, so it's like, okay, you're doing reshoots. Where's Grant? Where, where's We know this universe is dying. This universe is dying. It's dead. It's not dying. It's dead. This universe is dead. I don't have the numbers in front of me, but they showed all the numbers that the DCEU films have made. Man of Steel is up the top. Surprisingly, Suicide Squad is at the top. Wonder Woman's at the top. Aquaman's at the top. Surprisingly, BBS is at the top. You know, su- the Suicide Squad, which was the one that James Gunn did, made only $26 million. However, it was never really released fully in theaters. And yet, it's the better... Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> of that run. So now what? Now you now your last film that's in this vein of the universe is Aquaman. Nobody cares. And mm-hmm. coming from the next movie, it's not always gonna care about that one either. Well, Blue Beetle is the only I, one that I, is I'm separate. Blue Beetle. Yeah, Blue Beetle is the one reason, Kara. And they Blue Beetle's like an no, Else World. I don't know. Type. I don't I, yeah. I don't know anything. Blue Honest Beetle. to God, I don't know anything about Blue Beetle. Yeah, Blue Beetle is the only one that James Gunn himself has said he is a DCU character in his universe. Yeah. There's no tie so to the this DCU. Is, yeah, this, this is the first film from his universe. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Blue Beetle. Yep. Mm-hmm. Weird way to kick it off, but okay. I, 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 I'll, I'll stick around. Because that, 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 that just tells me that there's no ties to anything in the past. As long as he puts Ted Cord in that movie somewhere, I won't blaspheme him. I know the wife of Ted Cord is there, so I'd, I'd like to see who Ted Cord is if they mention it. Because that's all I care about. Because that was my else. Blue Beetle. Okay. So, oh my, back in my day, we had Ted Cord. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't have a scarab, but he had a suit and a so, fine car. I think that is. It was a beetle car, the, the, you. Blast I'm, I'm giving this. I'm giving. I'm giving the Flash a six. I'm giving it a six. Um, is it a fun watch? Yeah, but knowing what we know and and how this came out, it was just kind of like, yeah. At this point, you're just kind of limping. You know, you're you're just limping, and I didn't expect any. I, I went in underwhelmed. I came out whelmed, and I'm just like, okay, this is okay. You know, Ezra Miller has some decent scenes, especially the one when he says goodbye to his mother. Mm-hmm. Um, and the duality thing, I got that. I, I get exactly what you were saying, uh, cinematic assassin. So I get that. Mm-hmm. Um, Keaton, yeah, Keaton, yeah, Keaton has always been a standout. Sasha Cowley had a nice standout, you know, but Barry, you actually live to see yourself become the villain. Mm-hmm. And that was, you know, so anything they say at this point, anything about this movie at this point, like, oh, we had plans for a sequel and Zoom was going to like, look, 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 look. That ship has sailed, my guy. Mm-hmm. It's This world is dead. It, 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 and it, it keeps dying. When did this, it, it started dying. It started dying after Suicide Squad. 
Mm-hmm. It was it it what it wasn't a nail in the coffin, but that's when it started. Mm-hmm. Not not James Gunn, not James Gunn Suicide Squad. Mm-hmm. It was just what it wasn't. It just wasn't fair. It wasn't fair to James Gunn that it came I out on that streaming a little bit farther back. I was gonna say yeah. Justice League. Just what, as soon as um, mm-hmm. Ray Fisher started yeah. to come out, that's when it. Yeah. that's yeah. when it that? turned. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I, yeah. I, I, that I was about to back. say that. We knew. We knew it was over. We saw Man of Steel. Hey, well, Man of Steel wasn't like, horrible. Like was Watch terrible. your mouth now. Watch your mouth now. Yeah, Man oh, of Steel oh, was oh, not horrible. Oh, I'll, I'll, I'll down that hill. Man of Steel was mid. Man of Steel was mid. Man of Steel, Man of Steel was, was great. How so? <laughs> I will die. How so? <laughs> oh my how so to me or, or, or Spartan? No, how so to the Black Spartan? Why do we need? How, okay, okay. Right. Yeah, First yeah, and yeah. foremost, if Man of Steel was supposed to be the origin standpoint, number one. Why is he still at the point where he's still arguing? He's still arguing within himself on whether to kill or not kill. By the time Zod shows up, he literally should have been solidified in that. At the same time, how did the Phantom Zone get introduced? How in the world did how in the world did uh Zorel, out of all people in the movie, become more popular than Superman? It's Russell Crowe. <laughs> Again, the whole entire tempo of the movie was in true Snyder fashion, disappointing. That's why I said it was mid. Let's talk about that for a second. Normally we don't, but let's talk about this for a second. I thought it was depressing, that, but I don't know if it was, I thought it was mid. I think his telling of it was out of order. My man of steel, the way I know what you're saying. Mm-hmm. The way it was shot, it was out of order. It was it was like you're doing something current, then you're doing a flashback. Then you, so it was it was very like Yeah. <laughs> Visually. Fantastic. Visually, it was fine, but that's Snyder's. That is Snyder's that's photography. His bag. That's his bag. For, visually, he'll nail it. I'll give it. I will give Snyder that, and I will give Snyder and Span Boys. I'll give him that credit. Three hundred all the way to Man of Steel uh, or to Sucker Punch. The man makes great visual movies. I cannot knock that. It's his storytelling and writing that's crap. <laughs> Agree. I, I kind of agree about that. Yeah. yeah but I love but but I and, and I agree with her, but I do like I do like Michael Shannon as yeah. as Zod. He was a great casting. He was a great casting as General Zod. I can't knock that. Michael Shannon I, doesn't like Michael Shannon as Zod. <laughs> I, love back, I don't know why he I don't know why he said what he said because I'm like you, you, like, you don't like Star Wars. Oh, I don't like those type of franchises. I'm like, dude, you were just Zod. Like mm. Yeah, no. Don't, don't he, say that. <laughs> he's Harrison Ford grumpy. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Dang, that's a whole level of grumpy right there. That is a whole yeah. grumpy. It's so I it's mean, like, he looks like no like kind of grumpy. Okay. You don't know nothing well, about Star him. Wars. He looks just a say bit... something. It's that get off my lawn grumpy. It <laughs> is. Hugo that's that peppermint <laughs> lifesaver grumpy. <laughs> Hugo weaving. Oh, yeah. When you when you're starring in these type of films and then you turn around and you bash another property, it's like, dude, you. But you, you're perpetuating it, sir. That's yeah. Right. <laughs> the very thing that you don't like, you were I know, very. I know, bad. Michelle Rodriguez. I know. All right. <laughs> the Matrix. You know, you can't just say that stuff. Even like you, you makes you a hypocrite. So, I don't know. So, Flash is a six. Out of twenty. Flat. Out of twenty, <laughs> <laughs> he said, I'm "He's like, I want to make mark. sure, yeah, that fits. It's, it's a hard bill to reach. Um, we we could have just just let this world die. I don't know what like Aquaman was supposed to drop first and then Flash. Whatever they got going on with Aquaman, it, it's kind of questionable right now because they reshot, they recasted." A person who wasn't supposed to be in the movie is somehow back in the movie. It's it's, it's all mess. over the place. It's all over the place. So I'm just looking like, are you are you ending this world and then bringing him in as Lobo? I don't know. Yeah. Let, let it let it be so because I I want to see the main man. I yeah. see, I'm so ready to see. The main I think man. he's just ready to get this thing out, do the promotion, so he can move on to the next project. Yeah. You know yeah. so. I feel uh, like he's the only one that's happy out of the out of the rest of this oh, group. Yeah, because yeah. yeah. he got he finally got, he got what he wanted. I mean, I would love to see Ray Fisher. I still want to see Ray Fisher come back as Cyborg. I still I think would love shot. to see Ray Fisher come back as Cyborg. I would love to see that. 
I yeah. would look. James is the one to get him to come back. Yeah. I mean, I still want him to come back because, like I said, he he deserves a fair he deserves a fair shot. At yeah, out of out of everyone that was in the original Justice League, Cyborg and Ben Affleck's Batman got raw deals. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. And I was I was against Bat I was against Batfleck at the time. I didn't think he could pull. Oh, off. we all were. We all yeah. were. I I went on my apology tour right yeah. over Robert Patton. Yeah, but <laughs> like after, after BVS, I drank a humble cup of shut the fuck up. Yeah. <laughs> Because <laughs> it was that because see that because you've seen it, you were like, yo, like, okay. When Conroy even came out and voiced it and was just yeah. like, I trust in you, I trust in you. Well, if you mess this up, I will hunt you down. And, yeah. and I'm like, the man himself just said it. Yeah, I'm standing with him. And even, even his even his little short stint in the flash was still good. Yeah, that yeah. was a nice. That was actually a decent. I liked his chase scene. Yeah. So I like this chase scene. I'm like, I'm like, this will be great if you gave us more. And was of it that. me? And was it me that his his suit have a tint of blue in it? It did. No, it definitely. Yeah. Did. It, it was yeah. the gray. It was the gray yeah, blue. Gray and blue. Gray and blue. Yes. Yeah. So I'm like, I'm like, you. I'm like, so to say that, oh, the nostalgia didn't do anything. I said, no, that was the high point uh-huh. of the whole of all these movies was of all this movie was the nostalgia getting yep. Keaton, getting Ben Affleck in the gray and blue suit, great chasing. Keaton in these fight scenes, Nick. cooking. <laughs> old man Batman, but I dug it. That was old man Batman fighting, but I dug it. Mm-hmm. I'm like, it didn't I, look when like I, old I man actually, Batman, he I was actually moving sat like up. Like, I was yeah. sitting in the recliner and I actually sat up. I'm like, I'm here for this. I'm the, here for this. The yeah. fact mm. that my man Keaton got an opportunity to do this mm-hmm. was enough that for part. me. That's it. But that's, that's, that's what turn his but that's, neck. But that's what so hurts about this. It's like, how in the world could you give us that great point in the movie? And that's like through, it was already said before, he could have been a next. He could have been a point in Batman Beyond. He could have been a point in Batgirl. And you could have, you could have literally had your branch for Batman, the new DC world. That would have been it, perfectly. And I think. There's there's some things going around, and I get it. I get Gun saying, you know what? I really don't want to use anything from that world because it's so fucked right now. It's just mm-hmm. building That's on fire. old foundation is just not going to work. I have to, I have no choice but to start over. I yeah. have no choice, you know. So you know, some of us fans saying, oh, he's starting over with Batman again, and then like he's not giving him much much option at this point. But he has. He he has to go. He has to nuke it. He has to nuke it and wipe the slate clean. He has yeah. to. He's Destroy like all revealed. It, yeah, mm-hmm. it's all is what he is. All he's got left. He's has, all he's got left. Has he even mentioned doing a Batman film at all? I don't think he's going to touch it. No. The Brave and the Bold. He's, yeah, he's doing Brave, Brave and the Bold. Oh, right, 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 right. right. This doing, director is going to do the, the Brave and the Bold. Is what he said. Yeah, yeah. 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 Just don't fuck right. that. Yeah, it is. Yeah, yeah, that, that little Kira. Yeah, you should yeah. be concerned. That's that's what he's doing. Superman Legacy, yeah. the Brave and the Bold, right. Swamp Thing, the Authority. Well, I'm, I'm kind of scared what they're going to do with the Authority, though, because I think I Gun, Guns are handling the Authority. If Guns yeah. handling the Authority, I'll feel better because yeah. he's at least read the comics on it. He's okay. read on the Authority, so I feel better. I'll, I'll say this about him touching the Brave and the Bold. I, I I think the fact that he doesn't have an Ezra Miller type. On that cast will mm-hmm. help exponentially. Yeah. Uh Verb says, Do you think people not into the flash already would be converted by the fans to fans by this movie? No, no. I don't think so. Absolutely. I'm not. You're I, better off. You're will they be off. will they will they want to will they be curious? I'm sure they will. Send them to the CW and tell them not to watch I, season four. That's think true. that part. Or yeah. just the animated series. Go the, to the you know what? Go to go to Max. Go to Max. Go to Max, watch Flashpoint, yep. Paradox, yep. thank us later. Yeah. <laughs> thank us later. Although, oh. Greg, although Greg Gustin is still available, just saying, Dave. Yay. Listen. I don't think he's, y'all think, I think he's done, y'all. I think he's, he's done. He's done. Until, you know, like he's being, but somebody. That's just, like, that's just like Stephen Amell. He's done too until you start and say, hey, we got this wonderful script and we have money. Yeah. I mean, it's, yeah. what, it's, what, it's what brought him back for the season for the series finale. Mm-hmm. He, he, was great, him back. he was a great Oliver Queen, although it was kind of Batman with a hood, but it's, it's yeah. still it worked. Still good. It worked, you know. And uh, as far as uh, as far as that script for Batgirl, 
uh, you can go ahead and leak it. I mean, they don't have Marvel security like they did with Nick Fury. They, you know, sure they, do. dude, that story he told where the guy who had uh, <laughs> the Avengers and they found it. Damn, they said no, no. <laughs> my they made my man quit his he quit his job, left the country. <laughs> they tracked him down. You do not leak for Marvel. You you Marvel will come looking for you, and I mean hmm. that that's that Devo looking. <laughs> <laughs> it's where my script home. Right. <laughs> do, 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 do. Right. DC, DC might send the goons to your house, but Marvel, you can like 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 my grandma's missing. Like yeah. right, right. Marvel, you you steal something from Marvel, you come up missing. Wow. Right. <laughs> Look, the fact that my guy had to quit the job, he's mm-hmm. like, I'm quitting my job. I'm leaving the country. Damn. Is it the mob? What is what's wrong with you? <laughs> they, they popped up on you like those telemarketers. We're just calling you about an extended service warranty for your vehicle. <laughs> you wait, gonna wake up with that. No, board. they popped up like Jehovah's Witness. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Here we go. Hi, I'm Chris Hansen. <laughs> oh, good one. I want you to have a seat. Good one. I want you to have a seat. Uh, I have your transcript right here. All right. So uh it says here that you leaked. This movie, The Avengers, <laughs> is, is, this, is this true? Is this true? no, no, no? I spread my cheeks for the movie. It's the defense. <laughs> no, no, no. I spread my cheeks. I did not sir, leak. Sir, we ha- we have it on film, sir. We have it on film. So, mm-hmm. sir, you on Reddit talking about Marvel Avengers six eight nine? That isn't you, sir. No, 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 no. What? No, is I, no, I don't. What is, what is this Avengers? What is this? What is this Avengers? I don't know. I don't know. Uh, so yeah, somebody go ahead and leak that back, girl. We ready for it. Uh, yeah, Hub, facts. X, 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 Hamster, it needs dark sided webs. I'm just saying, somebody that's security ball who don't care about that job one day, just you ain't even got you ain't got tossing to nobody. Just open the security, just go in there and just find the and, fence and just toss it. Somebody's yeah. bound to find it, right? And listen, li- listen, when you put in your two week notice on that last day, just say fuck it, yeah. Just walk out the door. Just, just, just walk mm-hmm. out the door. What is it? Just said, like yeah. the magic oh, I, behind yeah. you. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I remember. I remember when uh, Wolverine Origins was leaked, I and do. we seen it. Yeah, and no seen CGI. it. Without, that shit, oh, that shit was laughable. <laughs> oh, oh, man. Man. That oh was or, or supposedly, right. supposed that Deadpool, or the Deadpool leak. But you know, let's just be honest. Ryan Rose is like, oh, you ain't gonna be no press for my movie. Mm-hmm. I do it myself. Mm-hmm. Um, so we're wrapping it up. Uh, this was a good one. It's always these are always good, you know. Mm-hmm. Um, kind of kind of break this stuff down and like hopefully these, you know, whatever's going on, whatever internal things is going on with WB and David Zasloff is not helping man his cause right now. So somebody's thinking in the background. <laughs> It's not helping him. It's not helping him. So he might want to shut that down. That man is the Yule Bowl of uh, comic book movies at this point. Oh, Saying that's that. a low blow. And yet, I'm not wrong. Much like the submarine. Uh, wow. <laughs> yeah, Tossing it, throw it in the sub. Wow. Oh my God. God. <laughs> Y'all are going to hell. In a handbasket or a roller coaster with you. gas drawers on. Something. Hold on, let me tell you something. There are so many people no, they're from Black Twitter. Purgatory first. There's a difference. They're, they're, they're at Black is... Twitter, at this point, Mephisto was just like, you know what? It's too many of y'all down here. Um, <laughs> y'all can just go on back. You know, you know get your you know, go on, on back. You know, yep. God is over there just like he talking to the five, like, you know what? They're fine. I think it's gonna be other way it's around. They're gonna look good. at Mephisto and go, and <laughs> why this one is here? just like who bringing a potato salad? Wait, why is all don't, wait? Don't you have well, a doctor's that, that, that's, that's gonna be quite the cookout. Yeah. Yeah. I already got fire. Like bring 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 the charcoal and like wait, wait, what's what's what going on? Hold on, like, wait, don't no, you no, have no. a doctor strange no, to go wait, kill? Wait. Yeah, you and Dorma move. Both of y'all, y'all can't get your shit together. Can y'all both team up and take him out? Are y'all barbecuing by the tortured soul? How y'all that is not what that's for. Who's just, running just, this right now? Just, <laughs> just, just don't bring no ice where we got plenty of that already. Right. That'd I can hear it. I can, I can see it now. He was just like, just that's just not what that's for. That's not get down from there. No. 
How did you get an extension cord in hell? I need to go talk. To, I need to go talk to my daddy because this is not working for me right now. I need to. Well, plug up the speaker. <laughs> Are y'all doing the electric slide? And y'all ain't got no. Nah. Hey, I'm like Home Depot, Papa Mago. We can provide anything. Yeah, right. <laughs> That'd be the only time that we actually need suntan lotion. Right. <laughs> to see it now, like, we're sorry. Not st they just took it over. We'll take it back. We can't. <laughs> it's too many of them. Who is sorry, it? Black the Twitter. that you're trying to reach Jesus. is no longer in <laughs> oh, Lord. That's when he says that. He's like, who took it over? Black Twitter. Jesus. Yes. I mean, <laughs> they're very they can tired. stay down there. Yeah. <laughs> They're doing great, by the way. <laughs> hey, 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 that it's one a new thing. It's a new thing. Hey, that one Jesus. Put him on FaceTime. Down here. So, face down. I think you said in the comments on the podcast, you said throw it in the sun. <laughs> <laughs> no, I said nip it in the bud. Yeah, That's yeah, what I said. Like somewhere, somewhere God is just like, you know what? I got these five up here, so we, we'll scratch that off. You know, for each <laughs> Because that's nothing compared to what they said. It's getting bad. <laughs> oh, uh, we're getting out of here. We got the cousins in the building. Uh, we'll, st we'll, start it. we'll start them off. Martel, tell them where they can find you. Uh, if they feel Indeed. like it. Okay. <laughs> 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 Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, blurs of all ages, good evening, good afternoon, good morning. Once again, it's your Frosty Bearded Blur Corn here. You can find me on Instagram and on Twitter under Navy Montel. You can find me on Twitch, YouTube, and TikTok on the road catnip. I am one half of the Blur Corn Speaks podcast with Miss Angie. Uh, we'll be recording this Sunday uh, to talk about everything, including Awesome Con and everything that's coming up. Um, I am one sixth of the most amazing wrestling podcast out there, courtesy of the man with the little brother shirt on here, the Color Commentary Wrestling Podcast, because we dope, we amazing, we badass, and we're melanated. Um, <laughs> I will be at BlurCon. I will be working and busting my butt, but the majority of these fantastic people over here will be there as well. So if you want to come to Blur to experience a cookout like you've never been to before, live with 14 food trucks and just so much chicanery and amazingness. Please come check us out here and just continue to be amazing, y'all. Because melanated folk like us, we kill it every time. We got to stop letting people get into our heads about what we can and can't do. Look, if they're not walking your path, they're off the road, okay? They can kick gravel and barefoot. That's all I got to say. Tyler Perry bought BET and VH1 in the same right. day. You can't tell right. me shit. <laughs> BEH1. There we go. That's what it's going to be called. First order of action. We are not playing Baby Boy. Take that shit out the player right now. Can we burn it? Every time we play it, we just punch Tyrese in the face. Right. What do you want from me? <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations. Oh, man. Tell them you they... want some breakfast? <laughs> Tell them where they can find you, Nick. Oh, yo, what's going on, y'all? It's your boy, Nick, the Sweet Geek. Um, Blackness. Yes. <laughs> Blackness, you can uh, find me at Do You Speak Geek. Uh, that's on Instagram, also on TikTok. Uh, it's like real estate. Just Google it. You'll find me. Uh, the podcast is back this Monday. I have been taking a nice mental health break, but um, I will definitely be uh, back potting come this Monday. I'll be explaining my absence. Um, I will also be at BlurCon and uh it's going to be a good time. Uh, I have a uh, planned first ever live in person, DYSG Live, with um, a homie Wendell. Oh, the brother. We're going to talk about some things. Um, there's also a wrestling panel coming up soon. Uh, we're close lining the culture, CCW podcast. We're going to be in the building once again. And I'm um, super proud of. Uh, the youngest member of DYSG, that is my son Donovan. He is going to be a judge in the first ever kids cosplay contest. Is the man at BlurCon. So, uh, you know, doing twin is cosplay every year is, you know, he might know what he's talking about. Uh, but yeah, uh, the podcast coming back and um, just thankful that I can be here amongst you wonderful, wonderful, blurdy people. And uh, yeah, thank y'all for having me again. They always, always, you know. Uh, the chicken's in the fridge, man. So you gotta warm it. <laughs> Proud uh, of you. Proud of you. <laughs> Proud of you. Lady, 
She made What's up, it. Everybody, listen. I'm gonna take um donations for my damn Wi-Fi while I'm in my bedroom <laughs> and not at my set. <laughs> but anyway, this is Lane from Geek by Heart. I am one half of Geek by Heart. Me and my husband. Run Geek by Heart. You can find us on Twitter. You can find us, not really on Twitter, but we're there. You can find us on TikTok. You can find us on IG. And you can definitely find us on YouTube where we talk about a lot of trail reactions. I am getting back to my hard roots and talking about that in video form. But I also write for blurredseyeview.org. So you can find my reviews uh, there. And um, Jay's going to be on Twitch soon. So look for Jay, Jay Neral. Because he's going to be on Twitch soon, just oh, doing his thing. going down. I'm going yes. to follow him. I'm going to follow him. I'm going to follow yes. him. <laughs> ah, Lady Mandalore in the building. Well, hello. Good evening. With that lovely blue and white in the back. Ow. Yes. Don't think that we is... weren't noticing that in the background. I here. definitely was. That's my number five cosplay that I'm working on. Hmm. Number five. <laughs> oh, you are doing it. Yes, I number am doing one. it. <laughs> um, um, <laughs> kids next door. Yes. Radio station. Yes. Um, I <laughs> am also known as uh, yeah, room full of blurts right here down below in the little uh, part of your screen right there. Um, you can find me on Instagram, YouTube, uh, Twitch, um, and fan base um where i actually hold a little audio chat room the first saturday of every month which is coming up on july 1st at 9 p.m eastern standard time on and my podcast is on youtube and twitch live on sundays at 9 p.m eastern standard time as well uh but up but but up i'm loving it i'm also yep. on tiktok <laughs> as child of mandalore <laughs> Where I do a little bit of voice work every once in a while, I'll throw something up there just because I like to have fun with it. Um, and my name is also a podcast. It is also Child of Mandalore, which you can find on Spotify, Anchor, Stitcher, Google Podcasts, and Apple Podcasts, uh, where I talk Jeez. in depth about the history of Mandalore. Please, if you would like to know more about Mandalore and all that it brings to the world of Star Wars, have a listen. It is. It is. <laughs> Yeah. Even if you can't understand what she's saying, her eyebrows are talking just as much. Hey, Jesus. I love it. Oh, I love God. it. Damn. Cinematic assassin <laughs> will be watching ship's computer. Let them know. Yes, sir. You can find me at Mayhem Media. That's M A Y E H E M Media. Don't matter what site you're on. I'm a writer for purefandom.com. I'm a writer for blurseyeview.org. Um, I do other stuff. I don't feel like talking about it at the moment. But <laughs> I'm dropping this Monday. So be on the sites and the places and look for the stuff and it'll be there. Um, but with that said, I always, always will continue to stress that mental health is important. So be sure you, you take your meds and take that PTO. And uh, whatever else you do in this world, uh, lean into learning, lean into laughter, lean into love. And we'll make this thing a better place. Right All right. On, right on. Black Spartan. Yes, it's I, Black Spartan, otherwise known as Black Box 447 on all socials. Uh, you can find me pretty much anywhere. I usually do reviews and everything that I read, that I play, um, even gym stuff, because I do a couple push ups and apparently scared Jehovah's Witnesses. We have got to put that in story form one day. Um, aside from that, I do have a couple podcasts of my own. Uh, my first one is my news political podcast called How the Frack We Got Here every Wednesday and Saturday. They can be seen on Facebook, YouTube, and Twitch. The other one is my video game podcast called Get Bit with my coach Joe Tonello that can be seen on Facebook, YouTube, and Twitch every Friday as well. Both podcasts can be found wherever podcasts are heard or seen, as well as on Aquilance Radio and Always Record TV, along with The Fleet. Not the fleet, the fleet. The fleet with the Z capital. My French is terrible. But um, uh, aside from that, guys, I, I know I, I was trying to switch accents, but the Indian almost came out. Um, oh, no. The uh, fleet. That's oh, what we're talking oh, my God. about here. We're talking it's, about it's, the fleet. Like this why, why you why you don't, you don't have, you have to move your head to get the concept going, dear Lord. <laughs> She's gonna this get a why, in her this neck. This is why I decided to work from home and not be in the same AT and T department as the rest of you. 
<laughs> oh no. Wow. I'm sick and tired of you talking about my people. Those <laughs> people, what do you mean your people? I am your people. <laughs> all I know is that you guys are a treasure trove of voice acting. That's all, <laughs> uh, uh, all of you. Aside from that, guys, the last thing I'll say is that, again, um, we need to be more about uh, promoting others, whether someone is promoting a business, a movement, a con, a shout out to Black, a shout out to a, a Blurred and Powerful, um, or just simply doing something different. It takes zero energy to do all of these things, and it takes 100% energy to be negative. Again, support your friends the same way you would support Beyonce, who does not know you are existing. Other Amen. than that, throw it in the sub. But aside from that, guys, uh, I only have one rule when it comes to socials. As everybody can tell you on this board, I am a very talkative person. We'll talk to anybody, but I just have one rule. Don't be a dick, and we'll all be cool. <laughs> ah, yes. <laughs> oh, boy, here he comes. Uh, I can feel Rachel's the... Hale. I can. <laughs> I get in that giggle. It's good. You're gonna get one or two of them. You're gonna get the the, the deep evil laugh, or you're gonna get the Joker. It's gonna be one of those two. Um, man, bring it back. Don't let him out the cage yet. Anyway, <laughs> <laughs> thank you everyone for tuning in. I am the man on the wall, Chris Fury, the king up north, the man with the plan, the captain of the ship. Uh, if this is your first time here, go check us out on Blurred's Eye View on IG, Blurred's Eye View, all one word. Uh, follow the link tree in the bio. It'll put you there, and it will send you to places like the Facebook page, Talk Blurred's Eye View Podcast. You can listen to us on Opulence Radio, where every Thursday, Blurred's Eye View leads the charge on Blurred Out Thursdays. Uh, you can listen to us and other great shows like Room Full of Blurred's, Montel, Nick's. In 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 black black Spartan over there, we we get we getting it in there. We all we see that. I've watched enough prices, right? I think I can figure it out. Um, <laughs> you can also catch you can always catch us on Twitch as well, where we're going currently. Uh, you can also watch us anywhere live. Well, not live, but you can always watch us live on YouTube, of course, and on Facebook. But you can also catch us on uh, always press record. Shout out to Travis Lawson. Uh, having us on for Always Press Record TV, just go to alwayspressrecord.com. Uh, if we have Roku or Amazon Fire, you'll find it there and just download it. See us in all this glory. Watch it throughout the house, wherever you're at, at work. The boss don't mind because they ain't going to know. Right. Um, <laughs> <laughs> they ain't going to know. Uh, tell, <laughs> yeah, tell, tell a friend. Tell a friend. Tell a friend. Also, go check out Otaku Noir. Yes, a bridal proud affiliate. Yeah. Of Noir. Good Go use Sorry. the discount code Blurred's Eye View at, <laughs> at the checkout for free shipping. Yeah, uh, you, you really don't want to miss out on the Taco War. Number one, Blurred Blind mm. Mystery Box Company. You don't want to miss it. Four Blurreds, buy Blurreds, art, crafts, cereal boxes. Yeah, yeah, welcome. Yeah, yeah. Let's go. Take your meds, okay? <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, once again, thank you everybody for tuning in. This is always a great conversation, especially when the cousins come through. Uh, we are here for entertainment. We are here to talk about not just movies, not just television shows, but comics, wrestling, gaming, you name it. You're getting crazy commercials from us. We are a whole production over here. We are more than a podcast. So thank you for tuning in and giving your love and your support. And go over to the YouTube channel. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell. You'll get all these great, great, great shows. And you'll get to see past episodes, shorts, and so much more. You won't be disappointed. We have a blast. We'll be seeing you soon at BlurCon. Are you ready? Yeah! Are you ready? Yeah. No. You kill us, 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 I don't care. Oh. Yeah, give me your shit. Let's go with you. Oh, oh my rapping. God. <laughs> 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 like, now get over here. You just get all romantical. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
Uh, oh, until man. next episode, where we come back, we're climbing. We're coming to the wind down of season ten. It's been a great season. It's always been fun. It's always a blast. Uh, I think we got somebody next week. I got to double check my schedule. Oh. <laughs> I got to double check my schedule. I can't oh, my. Okay. Uh, but I know we do. We got we got we got great guests coming up really soon. Uh, you want you don't want to miss it. Uh, but once again, remember to educate yourself and others, entertain yourself and others, and most of all, encourage yourself and others. I'm Chris Fury with the squad. Black we'll see you Tuesdays, Friday, Tuesdays, 8.30 p.m. Eastern, and Thursdays, 9. This was our special night. Yay. Thanks to the idiots down the street. <laughs> <laughs> Blew out the power for everybody. Uh, we will be back Tuesday, 8.30. Our normal time. We'll see you guys soon. Bye. Bye. Bye.